Cause when you put like, time into what you want. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Damn, son. And that's the joke, because then that time that you put in, technically, is it's damaging issue. yourself. Jeez. Yeah. So you, but you, usually, if I find if you turn it around, yeah. you, you st- you're still able to... I have an addictive personality. You always will find something that you're going to put that same time into, yeah. that same effort into. Mm-hmm. You just have to find something that you like, as much as that, yeah. that we were chasing. 100. We're all chasing something. Yeah. I'm chasing something. Man, but that chase is like Sonic the Hedgehog. It's like incredible. You don't think it could be replaced? 100. Yeah. But when you say a few minutes, like I've seen it. It may not be 200 bucks, but bro, 25 seconds. But, <laughs> yo. Be careful. Behave yourself. My name is Daddy Rico. This is One Take. And we are powered by the Rare Network. Jeez. Um, you know, this is one take. No Jeez. slip-ups, no additives, no gimmicks, no cosigns. And take some time and big up the family them that came here to speak with me on the couch. Take your time, socials, platforms, everything. Hey, hey, hey. You already know, okay, yo, it's the one and only. It's Mr. J Maroon. Please, yeah, on your Instagram, put the J dot M-A-R-O-O-N. That's it. I'm going to pass off to the queen right here on my left. <laughs> I'm Jasmine JXO on all social media platforms. So. All of them? All of them. God damn. <laughs> she on OnlyFans too, though. She's not telling us. That. <laughs> so, no. That's why we want to make sure. Is there Jesus. There, no, Jesus. No, no. The passcode, if you stay till the end of this episode, you might get the passcode, ladies Never and gentlemen. That. Never that. Yeah. Never that. She said no only It's a Rico special. <laughs> <laughs> what, what, wait, no, no, you go first. Yo, what up? It's uh, Scatterboy. Um, you can find my music on Toronto Made Music, Mama. YouTube, with no spaces. That's one channel. The other the other channel is just Scatterboy. I'm on Spotify, hey. Apple Music, all hey. that. I work with Jay Maroon. Hey. You know what I'm saying? Hey. We vibe. We write lyrics. We write rhymes. You know you know what it is. Hey, 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 hey. hey. Don't worry if I write rhymes. I, I write, write checks. checks. <laughs> ah. You know what I'm saying? So I am your host, Daddy Rico. This is One Take. You know the game. Um, see where we need to see me. All that good stuff. And don't forget to like, subscribe, comment, ring off a notification bell. And all that good shit. Um, so I'm going to ask the first question. Don't have my phone and only remember one question at yes. the moment. Yes. So can a man have a girlfriend while he's in jail and still be talking to other females? Oh, did, oh were you not going to start that part? <laughs> it just, sounded you, like yeah. she was because she <laughs> yeah. started... I had nothing to say. <laughs> Do I start it out? Okay, I'll start you, it out. You might want to. I think not, because, like, I should be good enough. The phone call should be coming to me. I have the lineup. I'm sending you that canteen. I'm writing you letters. Stop this. What so you're never more gonna do be you busy? want? Say it's like if college. I'm busy, you can wait. Go talk to your celly. Go talk to people on the range. Okay, so you're encouraging me to go become, to learn to be better, a better criminal. Mm. No. So what am I talking to my to the other cr- inmates for? Because socialize. Yo, this hilarious. <laughs> okay, so like she blessed you with a bursary, and this is this is the school of thought she wants you to engage in. Okay. Yes. So, yeah. So at this, this point, is... he's in jail. It's only conversation. But it's not always just conversation for some people. Some people Bro. actually meet love in jail. Pen pal. Stop this. I'm telling you, people get married in jail. Yeah. People be serving life and get married in jail from pen pal. Yes, From man. phone calls. If yeah. you're lucky, you might get a shift too. Like, hey, like, hey, you, from someone that you love, though, from someone that you love, it's it's crazy. Yo. How do you feel about that system in general? Because I I find when you're saying it, I I almost I agree with you, but it's almost like do old habits die hard type of thing. I, I agree I with it too. Like low key, small. If he was like that before. Like that now. You know what I'm saying? All we did was give him a fuck. We gave. Him, <laughs> oh yeah, 100. I'm passing right <laughs> off. <laughs> Sorry, ladies and gentlemen. Speaking of criminality, this one's kind of your question, low key, because like it was. It's for women. You got. You got to give us. I said my piece. I said I don't agree with it. I want to hear what you guys have to say. Well, I think like it's if I'm in jail, Mm -hmm. I'm in jail, bro. I'm away from the world. The girls cannot come to me. You know what I mean? I understand mm-hmm. you may think about what you happened book afterwards. But vis- this is okay. not Shawshank Redemption. In Canada, exactly. In Canada, most of the visits are done through either a TV screen nope. or through a glass. Nope. What do you mean, nope? Depends I'm talking about jail. I'm not talking about fucking prison. I'm not talking about prison. Can I'm not talking about prison. Which jail, if there is? Um, yeah, what jail? Joyceville. That's Lindsay. a prison. It'll, Lindsay is yeah. not... That's a That's a glass. So they're alone. Yeah. Like, yeah. yeah. So yeah, well, I'm not talking about prison yet. Prison's different. Yes, because prison... 
I can see you face to face, right? Yeah. You know, it's a possibility of touching and all these things. But when we talk about just the jail, where we talk about um, so so do you know the difference between jail and prison? Yes, I do. Okay, so not prison. Yo. Okay, not prison. I still don't. I don't know. Me personally, I wouldn't feel comfortable with it. Yeah. But. No, I can't. I can't see you guys. Point and if he's in prison, like, I was about to say, I'm like, I can't see you guys. Point, it, but right? nah, I yeah, can't. I can't. A lot of elements if he's in to prison, that means he's done over a certain amount of time. So. Yeah. Here's the worst part. Only. What if he was violated? He didn't let you know. I feel like that's worse. That's worse. If he was violated and he didn't let you know. Yeah, you know I feel like that's worse. If you well, let me know that I have kind of like the decision, okay, whether or not I want to still like. He was violated. Okay, he didn't that's have a exactly choice. why he wouldn't tell you. That's exactly why that he wouldn't tell you. That is the whole point of the question. That's exactly right there. why he wouldn't tell you. That right there, ladies and gentlemen. <laughs> listen, this is. That's why I say women create this lie to me culture. Okay, but hold on. This, this is, is kind of nice right now because I'm the only female here right now. <laughs> It's no, true. it can't sound like a gang, but that's why I said I shut it out equal rights because I'm sure any woman in prison would probably feel the same way. Yeah, yeah. Yes, but we're also not ganging up because it's a fact. I know you guys are not ganging up, but it's just like I need another few of my me. Too, I'm no? saying that's the exact reason why he didn't want to tell you in the first place because exactly what you said is exactly why it led to him. Okay, saying, but I, at least let me know. At least let me know. That, but hey, remember what you said though. Remember what you said. If if he lets you know, you would. The Leave. fact that you went like oh. And you said you would you think about it. It was that was the first. It's true. Okay, but I feel like I'd be more violated if you did let me know. And I'm here on street that Trust you know. Me, that could be oh, worse you're truth. talking to so and so, especially if you're a known guy in prison or jail. So we're talking about talking now, not violating. <sighs> Same thing. What else? No. No. If you good. get violated in jail, that's that's a whole different. <laughs> How could that be the same thing? You don't walk the same after that. That's first of all. That's the first sign. <laughs> How could that be the same to you? That's actually the same to you? Talking to another girl and getting violated? We can flip it too. If you if you feel a way, we can flip it back to girls too. Also in prison. If, if you feel such a way. I probably feel a way still. Right? I know. <laughs> the minute my girl says, nah. Exactly. Not, not even a girl. If, a, if she was riding a guy, I'd probably feel a way so I'm not going to lie. Women can't handle their emotions, bro. So if they were doing that, like, for her, she can't, yeah. actually cannot handle her emotions. It's Larry. He works the night shift. He's so nice. She's not going to write a guy she doesn't like. Mm. She's not. Mm. Or he's a friend. A friend friend. A real friend. Okay, what's the, what's the worst case scenario? Um, she's in prison, and she had to get some crackers. <laughs> but, like, you knew she did because you didn't give the money at the canteen. Women are... Women do that. How do, how do... <laughs> I don't think I'd be mad if I could... Especially if I couldn't afford it that week there, so... But does it give them the, the option? Do they? Oh, man. They don't actually, have to. I'm they just saying that I'm giving myself. Hey, listen, 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 listen. I've been to jail before, bro. You don't need to give up sexual favors for canteen. <laughs> and if you do, you're weak. Like, my <laughs> guy. There there are buckets in jail that will take a coffee that you get for free every morning, and they will trade you all five pieces of canteen for that. Fair enough. Okay? There, fair. there are people in there that will take the trash meals, the cold meals, and they will give you five pieces of canteen for that. One peanut butter can get you a canteen. So you don't need to trade sexual favors for that shit, bro. So I might look... I, actually, now I say it, I yeah. would look at her funny. You have to. Because they the jail gives you things that you can trade. It's like financial literacy 101, but we're moving just product at this point. <laughs> so, hey, I know, it's kind of false. You, right? you have to know to know this one still. <laughs> Some of y'all are on your way to the bin right now as we speak. So let's, I hope you took that in. Cause... Do not give up your goods for the goods. Yeah, and don't give up your dreams either because you don't need them. <laughs> you wrote your life. Just remember this one recall session. <laughs> so, 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 one more. Can your, can your shorty yeah. talk to her next man while she's in? Is it popping? See, I, I wouldn't like it. I know, right? I, I feel like either. I wouldn't like it. You know what I mean? So, like... I guess when you said it. Yeah, we're it's not my it, choice, so. but, like, I would say, like, I wouldn't want my shorty talking, talking to someone else. You know what mm-hmm. I'm saying? So she, t- what well, she tells you the same thing that we were saying, though. Like she, yeah. she can't talk to him, or she can't see him, whatever. It's just, it's just conversation. She needs to get by this. She like, needs to survive. People do fuck, yeah. fuck no, fuck no. That's, that's fair. That's true. fair. That's a like, very good point. That, that is that fair. I said that is fair. There. But then, same question is, how would you feel? Like you, you know, it has Even to go it's down. Fair, I probably wouldn't like it. That's mm-hmm. fair. Yeah. That's, so you, that's you what I'm saying. Even though it's fair, I'm not. So we're all humans at this point, so we're keeping it real. So yeah, for sure. Yeah. yeah. Whatever you want to do. I'm going to keep my double standard with that one still. <laughs> I'm going to hold that. Because, <laughs> yeah. I, yeah. I, I can do it where she can't still. No, not at all. Not at all. That's crazy. That's what happened just now still. So I'm going to admit to it. 
No, a lot just happened right now. Listen, I learned what to do. I learned some cousins I need to call and make sure they get their canteens wrecked. <laughs> Yo. <laughs> so I learned a lot. I learned a lot. They don't teach you this in power. No, they do it's not. Different. They do not. It's American guys. They Canadian. make it seem like you have to be giving up your cheeks. Yeah. Like, what? <laughs> Why is the TV culture like this? I mean, America. I mean, America. What the oh hell? Oh, my gosh. What's going on? Is the Chargers not charging it? That makes no sense. But it's plugged in, right? We're still, we're still. Yeah, I think we are. We're still recording. It's I just making know. no sense. Oh, sorry. But why is it not recording? We can't be losing this right now. This is crazy. It's plugged in. All right, whatever. You want my charger? Nope. It's too too long. Do you have a Do you have a Mac charger on you, Eli? No, no, it's good. It's good. It should be good. If it's not good, we'll figure it out. Um. So okay. next question is one hundred. Next question is... Black Asian Mom, don't forget us. Sh- yes, no, that's the third question. Oh, fair enough. Fair enough. Should men pay for their first date's babysitter? This is a very good question. Does anybody... First date. Get- not your girlfriend. It's not like... No. First date. I guess it depends on the relationship. But it's a first date. What is it? What, what relationship is yeah, it? Yeah, yeah. No. Because <laughs> I, I, I'd have to say no. I might offer, but no. If you offer, I might not turn it down. <laughs> Why? See, that's the hard part. Why would you turn it down? Somebody's offering to take you out. They want to get to know you. They know you have a child. They're offering to pay for somebody to take care of that sure. child to get to know you. Yeah. Why would you turn that down? I say if I really like the person and I have the money, I might consider it. Yeah. But, you know, you know me and you know my financial situation is not great. So. Hey. You know, you don't probably, tell them that. Probably not you gonna never offer. T- if that's the scenario, you don't tell them that you at all. You just say, out. "Hey, yeah, this is yeah, how you just take her around, right?" <laughs> you move slick on them and things. Like, yo, I got the Uber, so um, you, I'm just coming from downtown. Like, and you didn't even mention the idea of a babysitter. You, <laughs> I just see you, <laughs> and I'll make sure the dinner's ready. Like, maybe there's a way to just kind of slick that in. Like, I'm mm-hmm. not paying tonight, but if you've noticed, but if you such noticed. and such is being covered, mm. so whatever you're trying to do. <laughs> Like, That's make, crazy. Make it happen, cause I I'm eating this meal. <laughs> so, this Uber is set for one okay. or two. So I see two sides of this, right? So at first I was like, "There's no way she yeah. should never even, you know." But this can put you in a different category of niggas. Ah, I would respect you for that. Yeah, right. Like this is like buying a bottle of wine on the first. Week. Stop this. The bottle. Of, what if the yeah, babysitter is not worth the time? Like. That means the girl's not worth the time. That's very true. Right? But Same but but season. but I don't think the, I I don't think you know if the girl's worth it, right? I think you just want to put yourself in a different space. I feel that. Or if we're speaking like that, then yeah, you want her like you have to separate yourself from the other niggas, and niggas aren't offering babysitters, so oh one hundred, <laughs> you know, you'll be the one. You'll literally you know, fam, this nigga, like whether she doesn't like you or not, like no, this guy actually, like, who's gonna yeah. pay for the babysitter? Like, niggas don't do that. Yeah, yeah, he's thinking of the child. Like I feel that. I feel that. But My then God. again, some women feel weird doing it, though. All depends. I guess that comes back to almost the first answer, like, giving the offer. And then, like, seeing what happens in a way. Not a bad way. It is more like, you know, I, I do agree with that. So for me, again, We do throw out offers that we only would like to see your answer. Yeah. <laughs> you better fucking believe Facts. it. Just like when I... Yo, when the bill comes, you better fake reach. That's like... that. I'm not so, asking right? for much. Yo. I'm not asking for much. Can you pretend like you came here with money? At least. Can you like, pretend like you came here with just money? Just like search around the back. Can like, you pretend like you want a tip too? Yeah, something like that. Something Can like Can you pretend that. like you wanted to pay for something because you left your house? Yeah. Words are enough though, even then. You want to see that I'm willing to pay for a fucking $20 meal? Bro, pretend like you're willing to pay for $10 out of it. <laughs> yeah, yeah, Just yeah, pretend. Yeah, yeah, yeah. If you got to imagine, ladies, uh, what's that Neo video? But that independent woman, listen, we just, <laughs> if you could just do that. I-N-D-P-E-A-N-I- if you could just do that very same scenario, <laughs> and it doesn't matter where, from McDonald's to like sushi, like it don't make no difference. If that same scenario, I'm with you. Cause you, hey, so you right? Yo, that's why I had to say, because y'all know that ratio. When you reach up them sushi, what is that? Five pieces? That's like 10 bucks? That's like, nah, for real. That's yeah, but you can, you can, you can go to all you can eat. I like all you can eat. All you can eat are better. It's um, true. Yo, the more food, the better. Um, I agree with that too. There's a whole one meal thing. I don't, you know, if we're gonna go somewhere to eat one meal, I'm just gonna rather go bowling or something. Cause like, listen, yo, listen, some much. girls just want a meal, eh? And like that one plate, like, bro, I actually can't spend time <laughs> with you. I actually can't spend time with you. 
Yeah, 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 yeah. And I also don't. I also don't think a meal will separate you from other men. Women say, no. "Oh yeah, 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 meal." No, it, like, bro, everybody takes you on a date. I, what, I, I, I do things a little different. Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's you know setup. what I'm saying? It's a setup. You know, I'd rather be in a position where we're not just sitting and talking. Yeah. Where I rather put you in a situation. Yeah. You know, not not like put you in a situation, but like you know, you got escape rooms, you got shit like that, right? You sh- you, hey, any you mini golf and all that shit. Something like that. That I think that's the thing, especially when we mention the idea, because I think any parent would know that. Because especially when you're on a date, you don't take advantage of the timeline. Take advantage of the you time that you have. Mm-hmm. I, I think that's the first testament. So I agree wholeheartedly with the idea of like you know, like offer, make sure that you know. The Think kidnapper slash out. babysitter. I'm I'm talking smack. I'm, <laughs> I'm just talking smack. The babysitter is. <laughs> Remember them 1980 videos? Like, what was it? Babysitter, she with the rope and the three kids, and they're trying to escape. <laughs> Yo. Yeah. That was yeah. like the thing. Babysitters were gonna kill your kids. You know what I mean? <laughs> and I think when and I left... parents still left us with babysitters. <laughs> Every time, it's like to the point in sequels. It's like, yo, why? Why, guys? Home Alone 3? Come on. Now that no one learned the lesson? One thing I can say, my mom never yeah. actually left you with a babysitter at night. Yeah. I, so I got yeah. kicked out of all daycares gotcha. in Canada. Oh, whoa, snap. And then I got kicked out of all, like, babysitters in Canada. <laughs> Come on, stop. So, like, I don't, I don't know if you call them babysitters, but they're the, they're, they're the ladies that actually have them in their house, so it's still, like, daycare. But it's not, like, yeah, a it's daycare. Yeah, it's daycare. So it's home. I got kicked out of yeah. that, too. So It's a good thing, though. Um, what was it? Shit. I had a point. <laughs> It developed the Rico Live Show, which now all of y'all are here. <laughs> you already know, Tuesday night, we blow, we kill it. <laughs> Got the host of the host. And that's what happens when you're not institutionalized in the house. <laughs> Let it be known. Like, right? right? Listen, you get what you pay for. Okay. <laughs> Pause on that, though. Some of y'all actually paid, so I'm sorry. That's, that's true. That's the true. budget was real. Oh, yeah, my mom never actually left me with a babysitter mm. at night. If it was outside of her work hours... Mm. I can say it was definitely like family, right? Mm-hmm. Definitely family. So, um, yeah. Next gonna... question: Black history. Hey. In Toronto. Hey. Or we can say Canada, but let's let's say Toronto. Stick to Toronto as much as yeah. we can. Yeah. So you want to start tickets away with that? Oh, sir, I'd love to. Please. You know, first of all, I know I know it's Black History Month, but I got I got a shout out when it comes to education. Let me just shout out Alex Trebek. You know, one time yes. just rest in peace. Cause yes. They're human beings. Sometimes you can't just place on color. And I can say as a, a young man growing up, outside of any of their whatever, whatever, it's nice to see when people uh, with this idea of education can try and touch minds. And I think that's the very reason that we have. And, like, no joke. This is why we have, like, pieces like this, you know? Mm-hmm. Where all of us can congregate. Yo, Press you know who touches mm-hmm. on that? Yo. Selena and Creo. DJ, DJ Sailor V. Oh, gotcha. From the we just hey, met. We shout just out met. to y'all, but not giving too much power yet. Y'all got to come to the show first, okay? <laughs> yo, nah, Shout yeah. out, but like, yo. Don't you, mm, mm, you know what I'm saying? Listen, you send the insta. <laughs> but uh, talking on that, I want to, so I, I think it comes down to this. So a lot of us, um, throughout the month, you know, it's been a, it's been a crazy season. COVID is, is no joke. Mm. Yes, all of us have our masks. Yes, all of us sterilize and wash our hands. Don't worry about it. This guy takes care of it. <laughs> your security, like, right by the door as we speak. I'm very honest. Very, you know it's what not saying? focused on enough, you know? And not enough. Like, but the joke is when they never are, it's crazy. Been. So we had this, we were just discussing before, again, like where I mentioned, mm-hmm. um, for a lot of people who don't know, for example, in Toronto history, there's, I'm going to mention one example, a dude named Thornton Blackburn. And Thornton Blackburn was born in the 1800s. Yeah, that name I don't know. Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's bro, man. I wish it was practiced up in from middle school up until yeah. whatever, you know? But this dude was the first, and not first black, first person in Toronto, and I would dare say nationally, who created the cabbie, the idea of a cabbie company. So it's the first horse-drawn cabbie. And he used that idea. So he opened the first taxi cab company. Craziness. Blew my mind, first of all. This What's is a man called? who escaped slavery, was a free man at this point. This is 18 whatever. And we're still in the 1800s. Created the actual first horse-drawn cabbie, a.k.a. the taxi cabs, as we all know. Okay. Used the colors of red and yellow on the taxis themselves. Of course, you know the horse-drawn things. Y'all watch... For the young one, who is it, Bridgerton? Whatever the, whatever <laughs> helps you figure out where we are right now. I'm trying timeline. to get into that, but... That so, right? It was like, mm, you try to take... It was good. It's I'm going to try again. I'm going to try Shonda again. Rhimes. Everyone know? said it's good. Everyone said it's good. It's good. good. It, was, it was good, but when you walk outside, you're like, ah. <laughs> 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 you know when reality hits? It's like, get out. It's like, oh, but... 
<laughs> Sean and Rhymes had me sunken in that chair. Yeah. But, yo, to that fact, it's just, it was incredible because here you have, a, you know, free man doing his thing. Now, what the crazy thing is, is that blew my mind was that the TTC around 1930. I want to say 1932, 1937, between that timeline, they adopted the colors from mm. Thornton Blackburn, and that is the colors we use for the TTC to this day. You ever wonder it's why you're on the bus and you see them red and them yellows? Hmm. And then what? Was, all they did was splash some white. I ain't trying to be racist. <laughs> <laughs> I ain't trying to be racist, but I'm just do saying, they, do you they know? Cre- do they credit him? Not at all. The no, fact they it's the first... They, they credited him, let's say, 20... 2020? I don't know how long mm-hmm. that is. Because I heard it was a black man before. Yeah. But I never heard any credit. I heard it was a black man. I was worried about, did he even get a, a 10% royalty check? No, there's did definitely no anything? royalties. We know this. Yeah. Even know, without I mean, knowing, I know. By the way, this man owned properties. I should mention that too. Owned properties. About six properties. You don't start a died, company all without... That. Yeah, yeah, man. You don't start a company without... So man. much incredible history. And and the reason why I just I, I went off that was just because, yo, this is on the TTC. Mm-hmm. Like just in front of your face, but it's amazing on the th- on the thing. Yeah, like on those Patterson um little ads and boards. And again, it's it's like who's really on the TTC? It's COVID, bro. <laughs> Outside of work, like, are you really like watching? Oh, oh my God, I mm-hmm. cannot believe the next <laughs> girl. That, like no one's there, so it's well, like they, they have to do it so that no know? one can tell them they didn't. Mm-hmm. You Got know it. what I mean? And this is what troubles it's not me. Four hours. This is what tro- right? And there's so much people there. Is the first black man from 1933. This dude is born. I can't remember his name. Uh, the guy who brought us Carabana. You know? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, I just can't remember. I'm so name. sorry. I just gotta put it in, but it's just like there's an incredible amount of history that's been popped off in Toronto. Um, that we have this shifted the culture literally from transit to be a bl- young black youth on a TT. Like every man should have had a, a 50 percent discount, <laughs> right? You know what I mean? Not, is it Charles Roach? <laughs> yes. Mm-hmm. And he's also he was a civil rights civil rights, rights lawyer. Yep. Yep. Immigrated from Trinidad and Tobago. Bam bam, which bah, party bah, done? Bah. I guess I guess they win that one. So okay, Jamaica, so he's a he's a co founder. He's a co founder. So Peter Marceline as well. Yeah, yeah. And bro, they did that by mistake, eh? Because I went deep in that. In a it sounds like something that happened by mistake, and they yeah. started capitalizing. Yeah, yeah. yeah. he knows them white boys. Like, they, it sounds like something that got too big. Yeah. Just imagine Mayor Ford, but there was all of them back in 19... 19- <laughs> <laughs> that one time they saw Carabana, they're like, oh, I didn't hold. Amy, if you could... You guys, go in the house. If you could just... Ah. <laughs> so wrong what they're doing. Yes. <laughs> so wrong. That's exactly... <laughs> so... Oh, yes. No, pray for them. <laughs> what's, what's your... Faster. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> you know it's a uh, pen and pad. You don't need to... had to get the ink, though. You just had to drag... Yeah. Yo... I'm telling you, is is we have shifted the culture in Toronto so much so, where it's almost crazy to not Im- like it's crazy to not know. Sorry, I don't know how to phrase it. I can't it. imagine Toronto without black folks. I can't, but it's even worse that I didn't know that these people shifted the culture. These were the ones. It was like mm-hmm. like I I write a TTC. If I had known that this was something that we attached ourselves to, not that this would blew my mind. I'd be like, I'll be an engineer one day. But it mm-hmm. would have been something where you can feel proud. You ask more yep. questions. Maybe this creates more, you know, stability. Come on, bro. Mm-hmm. You telling me a black man brought most of this prosperity with taxi cabs? But remember, man can't catch the Jane and Finch. Remember, he's a he's a free slave too, right? Jeez. So so, so you have to you have to remember, a lot of our people didn't have no information on no type of businessing, licensing, yeah. money, nothing. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So yeah. he probably did all of this and was just trying to make it happen. He knew yeah. nothing about patents. Nothing about ownership, copyright. Oh, man. Yo, my, my grandma, she died maybe seven years ago. She, yo, in this day and age, she was illiterate, could not read and write. She owned businesses. Crazy, man. She owned businesses, didn't know anything. Yeah. You know, let her friend run into the ground. You know what I mean? Mm. But how did you get there? Yeah. Mm-hmm. People can do things, dog. We don't give people the knowledge. So we create things all the time. All the time. We just don't know how to freaking go about it, so we get those those checks for coming in. 100. That community piece is so vital. This is like, again, and I mean this in a racial way, but this is like the build-up in a beautiful way. This is why Chinatown is Chinatown. Mm-hmm. No one said on the map, this would be Chinatown between Spadina. They no do it correctly. It. You know what I'm saying? It was, correctly. yo, we together, let's do it. And it's to not say that black people ourselves don't get it together, but not there that, are times in that, that manner, community. Bro. Yeah. If we had, again, if we had them central supports, but it... That's what I mean. It shouldn't be from the government. It shouldn't be like, oh, man, I, I hope they can help us. Nah, it should always be like the way like we're hopping on the show and say, like, yo, Rico Live, done no. And make sure you tune in. 
DM the motherfuckers, all right? <laughs> he fears but it's like that. that Yo, remember, be... the Chinese got apologized. They got an apology, eh? Oh. Which came with a little reparations, but we all just kind of pushed that under the rug. You know? Hey, hey, oh. We're yeah, the last people who had never gotten a reparation in the whole world. <laughs> yeah, still waiting for them. Asian, the last, yeah. But it's just like what you, you said in terms of your own family, because they had to just say, you know what? Like, I'm going to just do this myself since everyone's talking and, you know, we could. I learn as I go. Yeah. Learn as I go. All day. What they say? They say, uh, if you get an opportunity, say yes. Um, and then while you're on the job, learn. It's, it's like, and they never had Google before, so dead ass. There was no, yeah. there's no, what, what, what? Open a book? She can't read. Yeah. And still, like, there's no excuse, man. And she's not, she's not, she's not, she's not one story, bro. Yeah. She's not. She, that, she's millions of black people that was actually doing business in that time. Yeah. My God. You know what I mean? That takes us back to Black Wall Street. But I don't get too American. Exactly. And. <laughs> <you> know, <laughs> You Bro. know, but it's not American. That's a real story everywhere. They didn't physically burn them, but they took them out of, out of business. One, yo, and when you say that, I, I can't help. And yo, I just, I mean, that's a perfect. Sometimes segment. it looks like it only happens in one place. They, they, yeah. People like say, oh, that's just America. That's just America. But yeah. bro, they did it here too. They did it differently though. They oh, pushed yeah. them all into one place, Nova Scotia. 100, 100. Still the central point within the actual Underground Railroad, but still when you know, again, of Africville and, and the atrocities. Africville, especially. Is, you know, but that's big. And you know what? And when you say that, it's perfect. When I was saying that segue piece, because that just brings us back to 2020 mm-hmm. and 2021. And we still worried about, like, when we talk about them atrocities, we're looking right at little Jamaica right now. Yes, and they're doing the same thing over there. Right, you... And you said it. You don't got to kill nobody. You don't got to take nobody out like that. But you did. But that's That's one place I'm saying right now, the Mm. people are standing there. We're not letting that last little piece go. Yeah. Like... Yeah. Yo, if y'all and, are listening, make sure. Yes, and mm. really take it in, yo. Mm. That used to, that that little block. It yeah. used to be the whole block. Yeah, it used to be the whole strip, the whole of Eglinton Ave used to look. There used to be a whole bunch of not just Jamaican but Caribbean people, man, business owners. Mm-hmm. Yeah, right, that was a Chinatown for us. Yeah, and now we're probably down to about ten shops. Randy's, fifteen Patties, max. Main show, uh, mm-hmm. Fifteen max. Yeah, job. Yeah. Three, 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 four barbershops. Yeah. Um, uh, two, two tree shops with the drum. Yeah. The Randy's, the, the entertainment kitchen. Yeah. Raps mm-hmm. dinner never closes. Yeah. I don't know how yeah. they just. <laughs> God is on their side. You know what I mean? Yeah. Um, that's nine I can name right now. So I'm not going any higher than fifteen. You, you don't even have to. I think that's like about it. So. Yeah. So you know what I mean? Say goodbye to them and, and welcome Metro, cause that's popping. <laughs> And whatever Jollibee's and whatever you know stockyards, like I just you can. I see heard Jollibee's it. moving out. Oh really? Yeah, with Nando's. Oh gosh, man! Yo, gentrification is real, and I think that's the the important part of I think most of the lessons. Because again, as we talk about these things, it, again, it's a great to have like platforms like yours because when we don't hear about it, history repeats. Oh, mm-hmm. yo, come said better, man. Like, history yeah. le- legitimately repeats itself, you know what I mean? And it's really so does. smart, I think, the way that the system, like, the government's doing things, mm-hmm. in a way of, like, oh, you know, hey. Yeah, like the way they're doing their thing? It. Yeah. 100. Bro. We got to be on us, too. They we- gave us the smallest bit of speculation with the smallest bit of stats. Oh, yeah. And they blew the world into exactly the world order they needed. 100. We have never seen all governments working together in one order. Not the way like it is. Bro, it's crazy. they're killing people's immune system. It's been a year people have been wearing a mask inside their house. Like, what are you guys doing? It's crazy. And then, listen, my thing is this. They told people stay home for 14 days. Mm. I understand this thing can affect people with complications, but if the case is stay home for 14 days, at this point, we all should have already got it and been good. Yeah. This is ridiculous. Yeah, man. This is like 20 days later. It's just worse. And then you now you're throwing nine more strains of the COVID that just came last year into the mix. Oh, yeah, man. But Bro, nobody knows anybody. Strangely, we've never seen, it. right? Listen, somehow Brazil made it all the way. I, I know anyone and it's would traveling. say someone traveled, but like, come on, man. It's like, I don't know. It's getting ridiculous. It's, it was like moving like the movie I think that used to be on Netflix. I can't remember. It was like... Um, Contention? Yes. It was like, Contagion. oh my God. Yeah. Yo! The bat dropped the food into the pig cage. Yeah. Jeez. And remember when, when COVID first hit and that was like number one on Netflix at the time. Yeah. But it's like, that's exactly... And that came out in 2017. No, Listen. no, before that. No, it was 2017. Whenever it did, it was War of the Worlds then. It was War of the Worlds now. It was, it was just an, a blueprint. It's kind of like the TTC. It's just, yeah, we told you so. It was the exact same thing. We showed you some. You we live. We lived through the movie. We yeah. had us. We just last. They they, they they sped up the movie. Like it kind of happened over two three months. Oh yeah, yeah. But yeah, that's beautiful. We went through all their stages. Same yeah. idea. Def- or was it debris? 
You have what's his face, the dude from Star Wars. Now he just tra- <laughs> <laughs> the man from Star Wars. That's when you knew it was weird, bro. This guy traveled from the galaxy and came back to Earth. <laughs> just talking some smack. <laughs> But real, you know, it's just like play the dude who played the reporter. I just can't remember him outside of Star Wars. Ian McGregor, I think his name is. But it, that's it was just crazy Ian because McGregor. then it and it just came right back to that racial focus, mm-hmm. you know. And again, the and the the powers to be and all the China and then super pro, and then the bat with the bro. It just and then the same thing we're watching on COVID. Well, there's a bat. It was a bat that. Mm-hmm. Bro, it was it's just it's almost sometimes when you hear this stuff is too incredible. Mm-hmm. Yeah. What do you say if it's if it's too. It's good to be true. It's probably not. I'm not gonna go as far as say it. Not it's in a bad way. I don't mean real. like there's no disease. I just mean the the level threat. Um, and, and sorry, the sure. threat level is definitely low. Like the flu, I really believe most of these things have killed us off more. But like I think now it has. It's... The numbers are way more detrimental. It's just this one. You know what? If the case is this is as real as it was, as yeah. they say it was, then yeah, they didn't have a cure. Yeah. They didn't know anything about it. So yes, it was killing people. So yeah. okay, since the numbers rose and then we figured out what it was, mm. now we look at it now, it's, w- w- the numbers are not comparable to cigarettes, Until, alcohol, uh, addiction, it's not comparable to car crashes. Yeah, none of them had an Instagram sponsorship. It's not even though. comparable to the cold or the flu. <laughs> <laughs> it's <just> crazy. <laughs> you know, COVID came with, yeah, had the sponsorship from Instagram and said, yo, if you could just you hold it down for a year. Like, we've never had so much again i think it was a perfect time like we've never had such a thing <laughs> sorry happen but the idea that with social media and the way we keep hyping things it was like facebook yeah. like the way but you know that's like a it's like a mailbox you know what's the blue moon's like here's my picture my friend yeah. <laughs> and that was like every two seconds there's a warning shot or like you know like, you people are really scared yeah people are really scared man. yeah people are taking a vaccine people are scared the mental health piece yeah. you're saying oh man that's crazy propaganda and we see, we know what it looks like but we still can't def- decipher it yeah and black people just coming back to that piece don't let this scare you from your opportunities it doesn't mean you need to go find people physically <laughs> we're, we're just dangerous people but you know what i'm saying no straight up like that i think the idea of again the education and principle a lot of what you guys have been saying mm-hmm. like, oh, yeah. mm-hmm. it just hits so square in the middle it's like we can't let even with the epidemic go down this is the time you know this is the yes. best time Read-ups. to be in school right now Yo, uh, I want to say if you're not in school, schooling your brain in just like five minutes, man. Yeah. School. I don't want to say it's the best time to be in school. It's school. the best it's time. To it's be over school online. School. School. That's what I'm saying. If not yes. school, you're schooling your brain. Okay. You know oh, uh, yes, yeah, schooling your brain. Mm-hmm. What? And school. That's school. a whole you other know debate. classes I done took. Oh snap! Because you're mod. You're <laughs> mod. So and she be going for them hard wanna... special so Vaccine, <laughs> vaccine <laughs> versus twenty grand for, <laughs> for the masters. Fast. Vaccine versus anti-vaccines. Actually, vaccinated. Yeah, yeah. So, I know the people who are with vaccines, they always try to make the anti-vaccinators look bad, right? And yeah. obviously, there has been some anti-vaccinators that made the, made it look really bad because they were in it for the money. 100. Right? But, 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 but they're both saying the same thing. Mm-hmm. They're both saying that you guys are both making it, looking at a few cases and, and saying it's it's bigger than it is, which they're both doing because at the end of the day, if you take the vaccine, they say, oh, it saves millions. Blah, 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 blah. Mm. But you don't know that. The complications down the line when all these kids having um, 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 eczema and um, um, more uh, serious things, bronchitis, yeah, asthma, and they're having, um, not not to say leprosy, but um, what's the other one? Lupus and all yeah. these other things. Yeah. Yo, dog, these kids are not just developing these things out of nowhere. Not to say it's the vaccine, but I'm saying the no, same way you can't say there's few numbers on the anti-vaccinating side. It's, it's the same thing. Yeah. Because you're playing with compounds and elements. We don't know if the vaccine affected that kid or if the vac- him not taking the vaccine affected him. Yeah. And we can't... Like, it's too new, man. This is like... Especially it, when they don't die from what the vaccine was for. So... Oh. Which is the craziest part. There's a not lot enough. of COVID deaths are labeled COVID, but they had other serious complications. Yeah. So literally, you could almost have the flu still pass for COVID complications and they would just add the number on the tally board before any real sound research. Because we don't even have... That's it. The foundation yet. It's crazy, man. COVID participated. I'm not going to say it didn't participate. No doubt. It, but they had another serious ailment, bro. Yeah. It's crazy, man. We're That's just going to write that off. <laughs> it's too bad we can't do that one. Like, imagine so you... Cool, imagine... Man. Okay, imagine it's your cousin, and you're like, no, something's wrong here, something's wrong here. And then you go find out, say, um, they have some kind of heart, heart complication. Mm. Now you're like, what the fuck? You guys just said COVID. Yeah, yeah. You only said COVID. Yeah. How much other cases are there like this? Enough, bro. Enough to fill an encyclopedia and a textbook. 
But that's the crazy thing. Because then when we start thinking about that, then we're going to jump in that politics piece. You already know Joe Biden and Trudeau <laughs> about to do. The same thing, though, right? The same thing. They could have met in person. We done, know. There was a, what was it, Port of Airlines? And they would have opened up shop. Yes. <laughs> one night. Like, what? Yes. Champagne, here we come, Trudeau. Mm, just uh, let me get some footage. Right? But it makes sense. You're going to do this virtual. So now it's going to, listen, if they throw on masks, I'm, I'm going to die. Not literally. Sorry, guys. Not wishing that. But I'm telling you, it's just like the vir- just the virtual meeting. That's what they say they're gonna do. So it's, it's gonna be the same flex, encouraging people to stay home, stay at your iMac if you don't. I'm so sorry because you're poor, and I'm Joe Biden, but I'm here to talk. I'm here to talk about policies with my friends. Like, bro, it's it's just a crazy system because what you just said is perfect. Because when you can speak them quotas, it's like me being. I won't make it sound even more worse, but it's like you know, if I'm an officer, and I gotta match a quota. Not every crime has to necessarily fall under a specific, you know, like stealing can be interpreted in many ways. So can like a shot. So like, hey, you touched me. That's aggravated assault. No, but sir, you left your bat. And, hey, mm-hmm. it's, yeah, it's five. That's I needed five this week. It's just that's how I look at it, you know, in a certain way. And it's not to say again that what's going on is not serious or not real or whatever. But that hype up, that's that virtual meeting is just going to, again, set the tone. Yeah. Where, you know, I could be a 90-year-old lady living there. I could be a kid. Same impression. If they're doing it, so should I, you know? Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. And there's not enough people that really <clears throat> say otherwise, I think. Man, where, where's Ja Rule? Where is Ja? <laughs> I just suck his face. Bro. Dave Chappelle. <laughs> these motherfuckers turned the yeah. world upside down. I'm telling you. And we're bowing to them. Oh, 100 one hundred, man. Don't worry. See how they're not speaking because they know we're the first ones to come before Instagram. <laughs> <laughs> nah, they know. They they know, mean, know you know, guys are being know, smart too. They're like, nah, it's not gonna be me tonight. Not me. <laughs> I ain't losing these numbers. I work too hard. I know. Hours. Trust me. I do it. I do. It. Listen. I do it for you guys. Like, yo, listen. I do it for you guys. I uh, hate me. Speaking of Black History Month, we'll, we'll be the martyrs tonight. We'll be, someone better say one word. You better breathe on that mic. What is it, AMSR? <laughs> Just let them know. Just let them know we're like we're still here. Oh, okay. <laughs> yeah. Okay. Let's <laughs> let's 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 go with this one. The mental health. Yeah. And the addiction. Oh, that's right um, there. Yeah. 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 They go hand in hand. You know what I mean? Like a lot of yeah. addiction can bring out certain problems in people that they never even knew they had. Mm. And I'm speaking yeah. from experience, you know. And it can lead to your life falling apart. Mm. You know. If, but you can still get help, and it's never too late. Mm. Mm-hmm. You, know you have to I mean? want it. You have to want it. And sometimes you don't realize you want it, but something just hits you and you're like, yo, I gotta make a change, you know? Yeah. Do you feel people who even want that right now? Or do you feel they're just kind of in rejection mode where it's like, no, it's because of COVID. It's because this girl didn't text me because my man's at jail. Oh, okay. He's cheating with that open relationship. <laughs> do you feel like it's something more like, you we know? We usually always have a reason why. Yeah. We an can't excuse. do this and that in third. Excuse. Yeah. Yo. I make a lot of excuses. Me too. I'm gonna tell you straight up. Like, I make, their excuses and i know if i didn't make those excuses and i made more effort things mm. would be better mm. but i don't know i just excuses feel like it's human easy. nature yeah. oh you yeah know, it's human nature oh yeah it's better than lazy too because then at least you thought about it. lazy people <laughs> yeah it's <laughs> the definition for me Yo. no actions or words that follow drug addicts are not lazy bro oh shoot you know what that's i don't know why people have that 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 no. that stigma i don't know where that comes from this... have you seen them work no, are you crazy? You what they what they ready. do is not cheap. Yeah, what they do is not cheap. No, bro, I... bro. Shut up. If you don't price. have two hundred dollars, can you go get it right now in twenty minutes? No. <laughs> nah, son. Not nah, and that I guess what to say. Not as you prepare. <laughs> Listen, yeah, I hear you, bro. I think that's that's a crazy thing. Do you, it's a that's hustle. a question too. Is that like more? I think that's so incredible too. Cause when you it's put like, time into what you want. Yeah, mm-hmm. yeah. Damn, son. And that's the joke, because then that time that you're putting in, technically, is it's that damaging issue. yourself. Jeez. Yeah. So yeah. But usually, if I find if you turn it around, yeah, you, you still you're still able to. I have an addictive personality. You always will find something that you're gonna put that same time into, yeah. that same effort into. Mm-hmm. You just have to find something that you like as much as that. Yeah. That we were chasing. One hundred. We're all chasing something. Yeah. I'm chasing something. Man, but that chase is like Sonic the Hedgehog. It's like incredible. You don't think it could be replaced? 100. Yeah. But when you say a few minutes, like, I've seen it. It may not be 200 bucks, but, bro, 25 cents. But, yo. 
But I'm saying, bro, like, they, no, yeah, really. Yeah, no, no, real talk. And you know, hard. it's funny you said that, because I was, like, even thinking of, I don't know if a lot of people remember this. Remember the shaky lady? <laughs> From where? Bro, y'all remember the shaky lady? From downtown? Listen, y'all go get school. Listen. What's going on here? Listen, yes, bro, yeah. Shaky Listen, there was years ago. This is how I know this years put between us. Black don't crack, though. Black don't crack, 2021. <laughs> <laughs> I'm young, guys. I'm with it. What is it? It's lit. <laughs> Slits, clutch, whatever, whatever the hell y'all. HBU, whatever, whatever word is there. Yeah, how about you? <laughs> Yo, you don't kill me, you know what I'm saying? ATM is like, bro, so get some money. So, you know, at the moment, I'm like, no, but really though, stop putting words with bank association. <laughs> y'all be killing this. Addy, but what's the Addy? I'm like, bro, it's already. <laughs> You're not really missing too much. You could have put R E S S. Like, it's, it wasn't that hard. It's like, why, why did you have to? <laughs> I could have put the R E S S too. You know what I'm saying? If you want to do it, put Addy. Yo, like just put Addy. I don't like Addy okay. stuff. Like you know what I'm saying? I hate that. It's but the Addy though. But I use most slangs. <laughs> I know. That's the worst part. Yo, I think it's Caribbean kids in us. We'll still cling with it. We're like, alright, alright. Yeah. This, this is the generation thing. <laughs> Yo, sometimes it just gets in your vocab. Like. Yo, for real. For sticks. real. Damn, damn you Caribbean blood. You say, oh man, I love you. I love you so much. Oh yeah, there's no mental health in the Caribbean though. No, mm-hmm. not at all. Jesus, mm-hmm. listen. Mm-hmm. Them fights are real. <laughs> you met yeah. some real psychologists. Cop go, picking go, or we walking outside. Go PPI light on man. <laughs> <laughs> that was the first rebellion. That's that's when it came. It was like all the, the Ghanaian language and the Spanish <laughs> just hit him. Yo, I'm not about it. And like that's when the revolution mm-hmm. came, Jamaicans. You should know. <laughs> take your history. I'm going off. But in terms of oh shoot. I didn't, I didn't mean to, to lose track. Oh, no. I do it all the time, bro. I lost track of it. I think we were talking in terms of the timeline of... of oh Mental health. No Jamaicans. <laughs> <laughs> Not a single Jamaican has mental health problem. <laughs> <laughs> Yo, a shaky lady. <laughs> yes, oh my who's God. a shaky lady? Yo, I'm dying, bro. This is the best show ever, man. Yo, so shaky lady. This is like from... Uh, I want to say almost like a decade back. I can't even from that that's like I remember being a youth or some shit um, but yo Shaggy Lady was this old lady who was just shake up on the TTC and I won't even like give what, up what kind of shit like I can't you know like they have cancel nation but I'm gonna do it anyways so it's like like bro it's like this and it was a constant shake okay and she would go like this and then she would be asking for change right so people just drop their money in mm-hmm. and so like you know she would do her thing and it was really heart wrenching I think I do you think one. she had Parkinson's? Bro, whatever it was, that shake was... It looked like Parkinson's, though. it looked like something she did. Pit, pit, I know a lot of them do stuff the like that. Let's just say that. No, it was like part... It felt. It wasn't Parkinson's, it, was, it felt more... No, I would say more like Parkinson's. Mm-hmm. But it, it was so controlled, it was like... I don't know how long she did it for, but there didn't seem to be a break. And she just continued. And mm-hmm. one man, one day, is just a reporter. You know, Toronto Sun guys, finally. The Sun guys are the worst. They don't play, bro. So he's like, I'm gonna follow up on that. And so he followed this lady... Up until she left the TTC with her shakiness, and then somehow, by the grace of God, the shakiness stopped. And <laughs> he was like, Okay, so this is what I go out. Oh, and seeing the sun park up on the side with the car, bro. And he said, I'm gonna look into that. And so he followed them to a, a condo, bro. Oh my god, caught like, bro, to the condo, and like. You already know the rest. So they caught the lady. Turns out she never had any disease, no cerebral palsy, mm. no I am Sam. Oh, no. There was no, Yo, that happens no rain man. There was nothing wrong with this woman, but she hustled it so hard. This woman was making close to, like, we're talking grands within a day. Shit. Ridiculous. When you mentioned that whole idea of, like, 25 to 200 for a few minutes, I'm like, girl. <laughs> this, no, this hustle. This girl was like, That's yeah. Crazy. Hustle's real. When you, like, when you were serious and you about it, you bout it. Because this woman was world famous after that. Mm-hmm. And I remember her. Like, I remember being a kid seeing her, bro. That mm-hmm. Pick level, a hustle and go yeah. hard. There's no Guinness World Record for this one. That's crazy. There's, no one, there's none for that, bro. They need to put that in the Olympics, but that would be so sorry. They can't. <laughs> they, you know what I mean? That's just like wrong. So, this is a black lady and her son. No, this was a white lady. Oh, so I thought you, you said know, it was a black lady. You said it was a black no, lady, didn't he? No, I thought it was a black shaky lady. lady. I don't, I don't hate on the shaky people, guys. Oh, okay. No shaky, shaky. Okay, okay, okay. okay. <laughs> I feel better. <laughs> right? Listen, if it was a black, listen, black you history. know they would have torn down that car. <laughs> Freeze! <laughs> <laughs> right? <laughs> Proceeds of crime! She was still done. Don't shake it You know what you're doing? No, but really, like, no, I'm so scared. Call my doctor. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> oh 
know why, guys. You know it's probably a chill thing. Like, yo, we're going to take you downstairs and we're really sorry yeah. that it happened, but you got caught. So you know one of them arrests. My God, bro. Oh, my God. You know this would be a different story. It was, different you know, story. Mm-hmm. I'm not going to say the race number. It was a white lady. Oh, white lady. Set up, man. I forgot how much thousands it was in the rent, but I remember fainting and then waking up and then fainting again after seeing the numbers. It was like, you know what I'm like? 18 to 22. 10 years ago? 18 to 22. Yeah. Two bedroom. Bro, that was, bro, she was paying for the upper epsilon, so it's like beyond. It yeah, but 10 four. years ago, it was pretty decent in Toronto. Though. Oh, yeah, oh, yeah. So the four, it like was a four or we've... five bedroom thing. It was like them ones. It was yeah. like MTV Oh, cribs. four or five bedrooms. Like, welcome to my house. All right, yeah, she's on 3200. <laughs> Yo, it's really lit. Right, yeah, that's, that's 3200. Yeah. Yo, that was probably. <laughs> Easy 3200, like. Easily. Without a shadow of a doubt. You know what I'm saying? Like, yeah, yeah. yo, like, how, how they, people they, do this? They only make those in famous. metro housing now. Right? So, Listen. Yeah, so. And that's, like, amazing. And it just it just blew my mind because it just showed you the unnatural way that a human can just transform themselves. So when you said it, it's, like, for real, though, because mental health sometimes can sometimes be taken advantage of mm-hmm. yes. in that in that crazy way because people literally will walk there and see But maybe she had something else that was wrong with her. If it was money, then, yeah. But she, she just lied about it. Made it more intensified. Didn't look like that in those reports. <laughs> no, I mean, she obviously didn't shake. Oh. <laughs> but there's something else wrong up here that made her even think that. Yeah. <clears throat> she watched Scarface. That's the problem. See, when you watch Scarface. She watched Scarface. And you feel you can do it. Like, bro, it just, it's this unnatural ability that she said, yo, I can shake. <laughs> you know? One yeah. night to her husband as they're sleeping, he's just like, yeah. I can make money off of this. Yeah. It's, <laughs> yo. So 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 how did so, I make a Disney? This should have been a CBC, but you know that special would have been bombed. Still. So there's also people like the girl who just got um she got her father fired. You know oh, that story there? No. So she was there's an app or whatever it is. Yo, money's a they hell of a thing. They pay you they pay you to watch you sleep. No. Okay. So Wait. She, so first of all, what is it so I can actually? I don't know. I'm gonna look it up for you. I need to know myself. You know what I'm saying? So um yeah, I do need to know myself. Right. So she woke up. And she must have seen the comment section, and then she's like, I guess someone must have asked why she does this. I don't know what he asked. I don't know what the question was. But then the res- he didn't ask nothing to what the response was, because she, yeah. now she's like, oh, you're poor, and you have cancer, and you don't have nice clothes. No. I, it just, she just kept going down the list of everything the person doesn't have, and I'm like, how do you even notice in my head? But So less than an hour later, her dad calls her. Mm. He's like, get out of my house. By, by the time I get home, I, you just got me fired. By the time I get home, you're going to be gone. Wow. So, she calls the police. No. She says, oh, my dad's threatening me. He's going to kill me. I no. I don't have anywhere to go. I could afford somewhere, but not if I Come leave on, today. Man. Which is a fl- understandable, but no, it's his house. Get out. You're an adult now. You're not under the age of 18. Yeah. You're also over the age of 21. So, it's like, bro, you got your dad fired. He has, like, what? Fuck you. Why were you talking to people like that online? The man gave you a good life. How are you? It's about hate social media. I don't know. So, I was asking you how you guys felt about that still, because... Oh, it hurt, bro. I was like a tiny one myself, so if that happens, I know I would not be sending no texts. There would just be a knock. Just kidding. I, I love my kids. But, uh... <laughs> I'm, I'm, I, no, probably, I probably hurts. knock her out, so I probably knock her out, so... I couldn't knock her, but, like, yo, there's got to be some type of, I don't know, like a prank or something. I don't it's know. like, what was... The whole point. You know what I mean? I'm trying to fathom the bloodline right now. Mm-hmm. Just like that's your that's your blood. Like, oh yeah, and then really... she told her dad she was sleeping, as if it didn't happen. She was sleeping, but she woke up and she said, "What she said." That's saying. terrible, man. Took advantage of the whole system right there, and then, yo, that's crazy. That's I crazy. and then lied on her dad. She tried to get her so dad arrested. Crazy. She tried to get her dad arrested, and he didn't get arrested though. Like, of course not. Like, okay. She was recorded she... herself. She was recording it. <laughs> She recorded herself while she was on the phone with her, while she was on the phone with the cops. She recorded everything. Oh, oh yo. Light black. She, they're not even... Yo, her dad looks like he's Hispanic. Oh. Mm. So, he's... Her dad is not white. Yeah. So, she looks like she, her, her mom could be white, though. Not that color plays an importance, but it's good to know. <laughs> She's a color girl. Good to know we need to know which area we're dealing with. You wouldn't, you wouldn't mistake her as a white girl. You wouldn't mistake her as a white girl. <laughs> is this Keel Street? You know, we gotta She's know not all here. She's in America. She's you know what I'm saying? Y'all know. Yeah, rich area of America. Which white girl depends? Areas. Which black? Listen, they all, you know which block on which block in T-Dot, bro. Star, yes. Malvern. Let's see. Oh, geez. Take your pick. They're not coming. Damn, that's crazy. They're I mean, I, I definitely have to answer that. I think... Oh, uh, man, I don't even know. I mean, first of all, there's no mistake in my mind no matter what went down. Like, I, I'm i not going to strike her dead or something, but, like, I know she's still getting kicked out. Yeah, I might yeah, have the courtesy sure. to give her a day. A day. That's she it. just got rid of your whole livelihood and you took care of her your whole life. She has a day to pack up and leave. 
It's that's it. And if if there cannot be a solution within how she's gonna help pay for this, bill, she's transferring all the funds that she's going to make and then she's ever made that everything she has. Yeah, I'm taking it. It's mine. Oh man. Well, you know what? She can return the favor now. Oh, that's a good point. That's a good point. But I would still leave it. I don't know. I think the father in me would allow it to go. I know. I know. I knew it was going to happen. how are you paying the mortgage next month? By hoping to put insurance in her name. So if something <laughs> happens, <laughs> I'm insured. Bro, you just said I did that to your daughter. That's even worse. <laughs> I didn't say her. Oh could be a husband. You said her husband. name. Something ha- Oh, her. Her friend. <laughs> did it finish that? Her friend. I would be pissed. Like, if I act yeah. like I have a job, bro, like that's that's my life. Yeah, no, that is your livelihood. But then again, goddamn, like no one should be fired for their kids, dude. Though that's the thing. Yeah, because there's a lot of murderers so, yeah. that really, with their parents have really nice jobs. Like, jeez, we didn't even know this girl after that. You could have said, "Get out my house," and next day that night, it's coming right through the door. Jeez. What did you say? I know she's crazy. She does seem like that though. Who filmed? Like, listen, and I'm stabbing him. And hey, Amber, it's like, bro, I could see that. <laughs> Awesome. What was it? What was that movie? The, sh- the Shivering? No, that's not the Shivering. The Shining. The Shining. Yes, I watched that one. <laughs> I played The Shivering outside when we were tonight. Yeah. <laughs> it's not no joke. The Shivering is real out here. It's not knives, though. It's just icicles, bro. Yo, that's crazy. I still don't know how to answer it. Like, I know I know I'm saying it now because, like, my one's lit. Like, she's tiny. So it's like, I, I can't visualize it. Mm-hmm. But it was not the first time we've seen. This go down not that way, but you know what I mean. It's gonna be the first time like some you know effort went down between the family and and the daughter did this to the. Oh yeah. You know what I'm. Ki- I was gonna ask how old is she, teenager like. No college? man, she's over. She's around twenty one plus. Okay, she's sorry, I didn't mean to say teenager. You said she wasn't a kid. Yeah. I, meant to, I think I meant to say she like. Yeah, I assume like right off the bat out of high school. That couldn't be no. Bro, and she's, she's making kid. money too. Like. No nah, man, no nah, bro. The thing is, actually, at the time, nah. she only had two thousand subscribers. So she was doing a lot Wait, for she's only 2,000 off- subscribers. Listen. She's making money off of YouTube and sleeping. But First she, of all, we got to find that sleep app still. But so she, let's keep that the, 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 the following day? Yeah. Or let me say a week. Because remember, I don't know how long. These things happen and like, by the time we see it, yeah. like, you don't know. Right? Bro, she had like 50,000. Like, Stop just, this. People still fuck to it for some reason. I don't Yo, know why. Yo, this is so wrong, bro. Like, she, like what she do is kind of wild. But, but, Yo, but we're, we're seeing wild. everybody doing shit. On purpose, like I don't know, sure if Gorilla Glue was real. That like, on purpose. No, that was that real. Was that ridiculous. was real. That on was purpose, real. though. I'm telling you, she was, was it a on desperate purpose. Need. No, I, I feel like she I really thought she could get away that. with that. Yeah. I feel I, like it yeah, wasn't on purpose as well. I feel like she can really get away with that. I felt like she dead ass thought, but okay, this is why I came. I was thinking she did it on by by, by accident, but then it's like, yo, where did she get the Gorilla Glue from? You know what I'm saying? But she stared at it like. Huh? It's no, what glue. section? Because the Gorilla Glue is not with the hair. It's with glue. I know. And it's in this heavy duty like, section anywhere you go. So, did she just... It was in her... Did she live with her parents? It had to be the county. Or, 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 like, does... Like, where did you... Even yeah. if you lived with somebody and yeah. they had... Suit, like, de- the, the, the Gorilla Glue, where was it? It it's, wouldn't it's be. It's where you keep With the, hair stuff. Was it you keep the dental? No. <laughs> it wouldn't even... It would be with the hammer and the tools. That's a dental. That's crazy. <laughs> that, one little, that one little compartment near the side, but you know... It's, Bro, where something ISO, is stored should yeah. tell you where it should be used. Mm-hmm. It's true, but I really believe. Come on, like I don't, I don't know. Like I don't, I don't judge. I don't think she, I don't was, think she was thinking that was gonna happen. Like it was. Gonna I really believe that. Like, she didn't think it was gonna be that serious. I thought yeah, she I, thought like it would come off and like yeah. maybe like a couple washes. See how this is not gorilla glue. That's what she thought. <laughs> So it's like there was a there was understanding. This would go back smooth and like it might yeah. dissolve in a couple hours. Like. There was no commercial for this. There, yeah. Sorry, there's no commercial. There's no YouTube tutorial. She didn't tutorial. use her head. That's yeah. what it was. She, she didn't know, go to the forums. Okay, I, I need to know where she style, found the you know? spray. I need to know where she got the spray. Or she the didn't go to the store. Should be, what was the push to make that happen? Like, what forced her to actually say, yo, it's Gorilla Glue? Or nothing. She you know ran out of her guts to me and she's like, I need the quickest Which thing Tinder to... date had popped off that <laughs> night? That's what I'm saying, right? It was so important, but what? the man from jail that she had the relationship with I was talking to other guys. Yeah, that was talking to... Yeah, she's like, yo, I'm going to put it down. This. But there's no way she went to the store and they never had right no there, like, other spray. That's what... Yo, I don't... I don't... Where I she honestly... Spray? Mean, she's capping. It has to be, be some cap, house. Come on, man. But the, it wouldn't be with the other sprays. Maybe it was last minute. Like, she was just like, yo, I need to go quick. I gotta Maybe do it. I have to do something. It says just, Gorilla, all right? Yeah. <laughs> it just doesn't feel like a scam. You know what I mean? Yeah. Like, yo, you could... I don't know. It just didn't You're feel really like a scam. You're really stupid for that because, like... Yeah, I don't know. Right? Because, yeah. 
Like, you would say it. You'd be like, yo, this is a challenge. I want to shout out Rico Live. Uh, Gorilla Goo. Like, I feel there would have been, you know what I mean? Like, some would have led me to be like, ah, oh, like, oh, no, this is not real. But, like, bro, that was, like, her, her, my heart <laughs> wept for Oh, yeah. You see? I didn't feel like bad, but I was like, bro, I hope they don't have to skin on her. You know them I thought they were going to, like, skin no, her I, No, no, no. <laughs> bro, <laughs> I, knew, I knew she was going to have to lose some of her hair, but no. She got all of it, apparently. Listen, yeah, but her first scalp of all, is probably gonna be Black History Month, shout out to the black surgeon. <laughs> <laughs> he's a plastic surgeon. I know he's trying to get his licks yeah, in, though. He's yeah, like, "Yo, yeah. this is which promotion, which, which station?" Mm-hmm. She, just, what she needs is just to, she she needs the money to be able to keep up with the different time. Oh, she's got it now. Gorilla Glue don't sponsor her. Tonight. Yeah, but remember, her GoFundMe page got uh, frozen. A lie. How much did she every, get? Every about uh, it got frozen at about twenty six. Thousand. Yeah, I think she was only trying to get like four or seven thousand. I mean, come on, that is a lot. Like for what, something that so was. Why did they keep donating? And then they want to... Then the, now, because she got too much, now they're trying to report her as fraud? You what? Gave, like you gave her the money. It's her money now. Mm-hmm. Wait, wait. So yeah. they're holding back the money at this very moment? Or because they... so many people have reported it as fraud. Nah, bro. Listen, this is some Karen bullshit right now. This is It is. Mm-hmm. They gave their this... money, and then, oh, now they think it's fake. But even if it is fake, you gave the money, bro. You already gave yeah. it, yeah. That's how business works. Once the money leaves your account, it should be gone. This was saying, you know what, little girl? Oh my god! You can well, then again, GoFundMe doesn't want to be used. They don't want to be known to be used for that purpose, I guess. So, but that's the point of GoFundMe, mm-hmm. bro. Did you not see the face and the hair? Like, I would have been like, "Yo, just go fund her." <laughs> Yo, that's well, she said she words. was gonna donate the money. Man, she's even... good. She she got a sponsorship now. She's she got followers. She's making money now. Mm-hmm. I hope so, bro. Cause yo, she lived through something I never thought she. <laughs> honestly though, it, honestly though, it wasn't that bad. That's why I think that's why other people did it after. You know what the best part was? Oh, they did it after. Of course, there's a white guy that did it. He's transgender. Or something he looks transgender to me. Um, <laughs> I'm gonna do this for equal rights. And he did it, and then he, <laughs> and then at the end he's like, oh, not hating guys. I'm oh, saying, I'm flying like, to LA to get this taken out. Thanks yeah. guys. And I'm like, what do you mean no. you're flying what? to LA? Like, <laughs> Whether you're straight <laughs> or, <laughs> or gay or bi, like, listen, don't cloud chase. No matter no. what, listen, That's don't do crazy. that, man. That's foolishness. No matter what, that's don't even pull crazy. up. I hate cloud chasing. And I'm like, yo, bro, yeah. you seen the video and you did this. Like, that's weak. Mm-hmm. Or maybe he thought he'd hit the same plastic surgeon. <laughs> that's Maybe that's the aim. All these guys are trying to get some free clinic time. He's like, yo, well, you know, since y'all doing the hair, though. So my eyebrows are kind of... Uh, <laughs> yo, it works, you know. Yeah, yeah. I believe that. You get cheaper rate. Yeah, mm-hmm. why not? Get Listen, a quick, get a quick if this bands. was the white girl or Lido, Kim Kardashian would sponsor this. Yo, you seen her walk by the house. Oh, no, was... Kylie. A white girl would have got a hundred grand though. One hundred, yo, Kylie Minaj. Yes. Yo, Kylie would have came through. You already know with the care and oh the, my the God, detox this is so kit. Tragic. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> and, you know, no one yeah. else should go through this. Oh my God, it's, it's just crazy. <laughs> I, I I will just die if anyone has to go <laughs> through this. Again. Jeez, you got boy, a few. Yo, listen, don't count your eggs. <laughs> No counterbacks to school. Bro, that's crazy, though. Like, you know this, right? Joe Biden addressing thing, like, the next speech by that girl. From Joe the... Biden said something? No, I'm saying you oh. know it would have been like that. Oh, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. You just want to get Save everything. our children. Yeah. I saw yeah. Gorilla Glue. Horrible. <laughs> don't say that. Gorilla don't glue to her. Stop the don't, making of Gorilla Glue now. Don't support it. There are many people in Africa who also get Holy this. Holy like, shit. You don't know, bro. World Vision. We're just trying. Like, come on, bro. And the pennies when it came back. Was like, this is Christmas. Yo, bro, you already know. It's like. I, mm. It's just crazy. It, is, it makes so much sense. Because when that happens, there's a cause. I always mm. realize that. We all know. Mm-hmm. And again, not again. It's Black History Month. So we can talk this shit. Yeah. Black History Month. I stand by the one, two, three, four, five days. That's right. And it's not nothing to do with my math. I just didn't know which date it was. 20, <laughs> 24th, 25th. <laughs> I know we're boarding. It's, it's near the twelfth. Yeah. But real talk, man. That's real talk. Anytime there's, and I won't put this in any bad way. I don't want to make it a downer thing. This is a, a reason why with the, the what's called the the year the gun thing, the Jane Kriba. Rest in peace again. Bless Which his, year of the gun are you talking about? Uh, the Toronto Perth, or Jamaica? Toronto. It's Toronto. Okay, okay, yeah, the okay. year of the gun is a young lady named Jane Kriba. Mm-hmm. Uh, young, young and dumb. I know. I remember Jane Yeah, Kriba. you remember that? Yeah, of course. I remember, I remember all that. Remember how, like, how 50, I, whatever. Was that, like, I, I, ain't that I ain't that young. I ain't that young. Is it 2005? I, I is it that long ago? Like, yeah. yeah. 2005? Yeah. Like, Drake had I was thinking more like 07, 08. Yeah. He was still there. Huh? Yeah, you're right. Yo, yeah, yeah, that was, yeah. Maybe even before 05. Yeah. You're right. You're yeah. right. Yeah. 
<laughs> this is before Drake. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. He's, yeah, he you're was right. in comeback season. Yeah. No, no, this is before Drake even. Yeah, this is before Drake. Yeah, Drake this was even like, singing. No, no, Fraud was on the grass. Yeah, he was on. Yeah, he was on. Exactly, yo. So the, you know. Yes, he's on the grass. So you know at this he point. was there in the dressing yeah. room. So Forty was there. Listen, don't discount it. Someone down. I'll tell you. Hey, guys, listen to my new. <laughs> you get shot to name. Are you right? <laughs> Guys, can I do the rap for the next set? All right. <laughs> yo, yo, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. But real talk, before that, you know, it just it still killed me because that's the point. Fifty or something, and I know it's not. I, I can't even say I'm exaggerating. I know it touched like forty some uh, people in our areas. Mm. Don't matter where. I don't even want to have that debate. A lot of colored people died in that season. Mm -hmm. When Jane Creeper got hit, it became the cause. Of like the Toronto's turn of century, yes. it's like where all the money got pumped through. It was like a hundred million or something, bro. Yeah. This is where everything got covered from like mm -hmm. the Jamestown, like when they did the whole like operate, bro. Everything they had been doing before, they had money for. Jane Creep was like again mm -hmm. the cause, the push. And 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 and, yeah. and and look what happened with um with, uh, C W Jeffries. Ah yeah yeah ah Jordan man. Mm -hmm. To this day, bro. But it, all they remember is C W Jeffries. That's yeah. it. Because that's all the publicity was given to. Oh yeah. The what, shooting at JCW. What a tragic shooting at the school. What a... You, and we... Oh, my God. If we can give some money to the... To the school. Oh, my Lord. What's their the name? The mom again? received nothing. Yeah, man. Like, the bro, mom received nothing crazy. to this day. I'm sure Creven has a whole thing. And again, it's he's not so hating. Strange. It's just like, yo, this is how crazy things is. This, this is going to be a, a built-up legacy. Yeah. And these are young people that we got to celebrate. And not on a level where it's like we got to like hang our heads low and be like, oh my God. It's but gotten worse. Remember? Yeah. Right? It is. The year of the gun, we've tripled that almost. Oh yeah, bro. Oh yeah. The Who's only the difference well, is there's a lot I of oh, sorry, no, it's a, Who's it they got shot at the most in Indies race? Which one? That what? Year, most in Indies or some some race. Oh, the, like oh, recently? Downtown. The most in place? Yeah, yeah, this was years ago during some race. Oh, I, bro. that And a boy got shot and the piece mm. of the bullet was still in him. Oh, bro, that has this to be was one a of... while ago, a long time ago. Is that like, the one where it went into the daycare? I don't know. I wouldn't know that anyone. I'm be honest. No. I wouldn't know. I can't remember. That it to be like two thousand. Bro, this is too much. I think that's like literally the point. Yeah, that is like, mm -hmm. point. I'm sure between all of us, we've all lost at least five friends. I, I probably together, one, you know, five, ten, fifteen, twenty. That's still too much. That's just yeah, a crazy. It's way too much. One is still too much. Yeah, no matter yeah. what. So but I guess the thing is, yeah. okay, so when it comes to violence in our city, yeah. Um, I can't just blame it on like the 12, 15 year olds. It's not no. just their fault because there's people even my age and even older. You know, I don't know, there's certain rappers in the city that only, they have the 6 9 formula. They only do the violence. And you know, it's, it's not really their fault. It's oh, not yeah. Keep 6 Solid's fault. It's not 6 Wars' fault. It's not 6 Bus' fault. Yeah. It's, it's a lot of our faults. Yeah. We encourage them to keep acting like dumbasses. Mm -hmm. yeah. And they act like dumbasses, talking mm -hmm. about people's families, dead friends, and yeah. then they're creating a haters, and it's a cycle. Yeah, 100. We, people are only listening to you when you have shit to talk about, dead homies, and, and, and people's, people's families. They don't listen to you and have anything else to say. So now, you're only going to say those things. Right. So now, we've incited the violence, and then when you kill somebody, oh, he's a waste crazy. man, he's an idiot. Why it's would he crazy. do that? Yeah, man. So what, what the fuck? Then you, oh, you want to get mad that that six buzz is, 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 is only posts top five chroma da, 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 because you guys only interact with those posts mm -hmm. yeah yeah mm -hmm. this is a business those guys are not gonna fucking keep posting this lovey dovey shit that you guys that they, they see only a hundred comments yeah as opposed to a hundred thousand comments yeah mm -hmm. is it giving buddy yeah they have they make money they need to have they need to have the flow there they need to have their comments and their likes out of this world 100 yeah, yeah. so if you if top five is what's gonna get it oh, top five is it. what's gonna get it the oldest looking young bro, boy on the planet. Bro, if 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 they could get clicks like that on on gay posts and transgender stuff, they would do oh, it they'd too. Be killing it. Yeah. They would do it too. Yeah. Whatever you guys choose to interact with is what these guys are gonna give you. One hundred, and that's the craziest thing too. I think that's the biggest point, and it comes back to our piece on the uh, the education piece. Is is straight up like if madam, are, if they're aware, they'll they'll do it. If they are aware, they will do it. And sorry. Let me get them. Let me get them. <laughs> <laughs> you know, but it goes. I think it just goes to do if they if they understand what's what's uh, the options are and the opportunities. Again, that's like as much as someone seeing. Oh shoot, I can do a Rico thing. Yo, yeah, bro. If you just set this and you put this and you grab the equipment and da da da, like bro, and then they'll go forward. But it's like we have to just let them see it and then we have to continue to push it. Cause again, that's kind of like that TC sorry that TTC thing. 
No, we know this, bro. They're playing them, putting these posts, and remember these guys, but it's like no one's here. Yeah, no but one's in this time, spaces. though, mm-hmm. in this time, right? we have so much information. We see it. We do see it. Yeah. Can you pretend like you don't see it? You can't. This is the sadness with the idea with the year of the gun and all that, because we took a lot of elders out the game. You know? And not, yes. I shouldn't say in a good or bad way, because everything happens for a reason and whatever mistakes, but I feel like a lot of elders who would have schooled them would have been. I, I disagree. You know? I disagree with that narrative. Fair enough. I disagree fair enough. with it. And I'll tell you why I disagree with it. Yeah. Because those elders were on fuckery and they would encourage it. Jerry. Jerry. As much Jerry. as they say, oh, they could talk to them, they could. They wouldn't. Good point. And they was, say, yo, why is he still talking? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Mm-hmm. They're not going to say, yo, your life is worth more. I don't want to see you in jail. Oh, yeah. They might say that after they gave you the gun to go kill him, now you're in jail. Oh, man, you shouldn't be here. 100. I feel that. I feel bro, that. a lot of the OGs are on fuckery, bro. Mm. You're fucking 40 years old and you still want to gangbang. You're not teaching me nothing. Mm-hmm. 100. Yo, it's crazy. Fam, yeah. some of these kids, and they see you and they know this. They don't want to be you. Yeah, yeah. They may be 20 right now, 23, doing dumb shit, but they know when they're 40, they don't want to do this. 100. As stupid as they are right now, they know they don't want to be you when they're 40. Even when they started, they didn't want to do it. I think that's a great... But One again, thing they know, the streets is not for them when they're older. Yeah. Mm-hmm. They're not that stupid. Yeah. It's just the idea... But they think they can get away with everything now. Yeah. But that's the mentality when you're young, right? And like, they don't think it catches up with you either. Even if oh, you're yeah. not in jail, they think it won't catch up with you. Forever young. That m- mortality is crazy. Like, But most of us were swinging, you know what I mean? Like, meaning like, you just hop from... I remember you just hop from the, the fence. Nowadays, it's like, oh... Yo, I just... <laughs> I take my time. It's like, it's crazy the amount of spirit and energy, but the focus, you you almost feel invincible. Don't make a difference. You feel like mm-hmm. you can just drop down, come back. It's all good. Mm-hmm. You know? Like, you the skater boys, you know? You can crack open the shit. And they treat it like it's a game. Like, uh, where, you know, you can reset it. And that's the interesting thing, because it does, it does play in our humanistic nature, because young people are meant to rebel. Yep. Down to James, was it James Dean? Rebel without a cause. Even the white boys were saying, nah, bro. I like black kids. <laughs> yep. <gasps> Yo, a lot of motherfuckers in our community have never been shot and they've never been stabbed. 100. So you know what? Sorry. Maybe they've broken a bone, though. Yeah. And they think that's almost the same. Yeah. Listen, let me tell you something. When a knife or a gun goes inside you, a bullet, I should say, you were, yo, ligaments... Uh, 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 what is this stuff inside? Organs. Yeah. Bro, shit's getting torn, eh? Mm-hmm. mm-hmm. <laughs> Yo, they think it's a joke until it hits their skin. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Now it's want to give their life to God. Now it's da 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 da. Whatever. Bro, you shouldn't have needed to get shot to understand the feeling. I don't need to jump off a cliff to know what's going to happen. 100. Yeah. Mm-hmm. Jeez, but then some of them do it anyways. <laughs> well, that yo, if you try if you know you want to end your life. Yeah. Yeah. I call them extreme athletes. <laughs> you know what's the ones who jump from the... You know the ones? Yo, you know what I'm talking about. Jeez, bro. <laughs> You're mad. Down the mountain top, like, bro, this is not the way. If you needed to go, we could have just... Just call me from the, the condo, bro. We didn't have to go like this. Man. It's crazy. Yo, some people are mad like that, though. Yeah, drama Jordan. will always be more entertaining. Yeah. And I think more mm-hmm. importantly, we will always find people who do love. And again, I think that's where the mentality piece is those who can also uh, be in love with death as much as... Other people who can be in love with life. I Meaning, you know, the thing is, they don't think the death is coming, like we said, right? Yeah. So it's more, it's more entertaining. Like yeah. they're willing to do what we tell them to. Yo, and it's crazy. Yeah, they'll do whatever it takes. Yeah, whatever it takes to get a job. <gasps> oh, Jesus, I can't. Like, bro, it's like it's not cool. It's not cool. It's not cool. I mean, if you can avoid getting yeah. a job, I hear you. But like, I'm not trying to risk my life, bro. Awesome some realness. There was no, a time man. I was, but like, come on, bro. How Yo. stupid was that? It's crazy. Mm-hmm. It's crazy, man. You know, yeah. the societal yeah. pieces that we live through, I think it's the constant struggle. But for us, we know uh, not only are we one step ahead, it's like we have to always give a forethought. We almost have to, like, agree with... Like, we know that the rules of the game is a monopoly. Mm-hmm. But it's like, yeah, yo, but, it, you know, because you're black, you're just going to start with this one, though. And, <laughs> my bad. Like, you know, my friends were not able to talk. Like, you know, like, you know the game, but it's like, bro, we're either, either you down and you will put your chip down and get ready mm-hmm. with your little cash and build up, or, you know, you can't exit the game. There's there's many ways to exit that game, though. But mm-hmm. I, I like, that's why I like stuff like Monopoly. But I mean, I'm just kind of giving it Me that too. metaphor where it's like, we do know society for what it is. Mm-hmm. You know, I have seen, again, like, my mentality has changed in ways where it's like, um, 
I've always been understanding of like the the police in, in some ways, mainly because like I had uh, like uncles, like an uncle who's an officer, like he was a sergeant in Jamaica. I'm understanding in certain ways. Yeah, yeah. It's, you know what I mean. But I understood yeah. it because like I, I, you're protecting your people, and because you're in Jamaica, like who else you see but mostly your faces. So I can almost imagine that sheriff attitude. So it's like when you're in the Western world, it's like nah, bro, it's the uncle, uncle B. It's not the same way. <laughs> Whatever you think is up, to, nah. But it's funny because you know what I mean. Same way what happened with the year of the gun, they employed the same Jamaicans to come up them, yeah, teach them mm-hmm. how to infiltrate. Because again, they're not looking for anything but beyond trying to. Uh, so I don't think it's a good know? idea for our people to communicate to, to 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 to. I don't think oh, yeah. I don't. Okay, I think pe- people say police should police in the community that they grew up in. No, they no. shouldn't, because it's not a joke. It's not a joke when we say that they do want to get people back. It's never been a joke. Yeah. That is fucking real. Yeah. You know, and then especially people are like in our community that want to become cops in this country. It's tough, bro, man. They hate us. Mm-hmm. Besides me. They hate us because <laughs> they think we make them look bad. Yeah. So yeah. it's like, yo, you cannot have any color race cop in their in their own community where they were raised. Yeah. Because they went to high school with these people. Yeah, man. They can't get them to get their kids. And it's fucked up. Yeah. And then we have the coloreds that go for their own coloreds because they think they make them look bad, which yeah. mm-hmm. you're giving them a you're giving them a, a record now, which I don't understand. It. It's crazy, right? Yo, it's crazy, bro. Slave mentality, right? Yeah. In my in my opinion. No, one hundred. Was it Karis once said? Um, you don't know how I rap. You don't know how I rap. And he had the the one line where he's talking about. He was trying to take us back to Egypt. He said, "Check it out, did it." Officer, 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 and he goes fast. He just says, "Officer, officer, officer." So mm-hmm. he went from overseer to officer. Nothing has changed in the span of them thousand years. Same ideology, same whip crack, same like yo, you gonna build this? And I swear to God, if you don't, I'm gonna bury in the sand from whence you came. Mm-hmm. But uh, you know, hey ladies, what's up? Nah, nothing, bro. Just chilling with the fucking baby. What's up? Like it's the same mentality. It has nothing changed here. But I think again that w- those Western principles. It's just crazy because they'll take from like again an Egypt mentality. They'll yep. take from the Rome. They'll take these powers. But there's these mentalities again that American mentality, for instance. They just try to make it seem like we complain too much because we yeah. don't pick our battles. Because you still got them three fifths on the friggin' amendments down over in um what's it called in the states. Like as long as there's that's a lot of in places book, with three fifth going on yeah. all day. So you know what I mean. Or if we go back and we can kick all cultures. Who cares? It could be like Japanese indentured in Vancouver. It could be the Chinese who did the railroad here. It wasn't just John Henry, apparently. I thought, like, damn, there's more? Just John Henry. <laughs> it wasn't just him, bro. Like, you <laughs> jokes. Nah, yo, these guys, yo, yo, we yeah, didn't. competition. We, Canada, actually, we didn't enslave people. We had a lot of people here to, that were only here through slavery. Bro, you know? It's crazy. I don't know how we just pretend like Chinese people are here for no reason. Nah, I think we just had a win with the... Black people just here for no reason. Nah. <laughs> Black people were either escaping slavery? Yeah. Or they were freed as a slave in this country. Yeah. It's like, there's only one way about it. Which is crazy. And I think that's where that mental piece is so crazy. Sorry, when I keep saying crazy. <laughs> like, they think Africville... That's the yeah. They think Africville makes sense if they tell us, oh, because Jamaicans and Caribbeans were going there. Bro, that's a far fucking place from Jamaica. Yeah. It's a far fucking place from anywhere in the Caribbean. It's oh, not yeah. Florida, bro. Yeah. No, you guys... These were fucking... A lot of these people were slaves running from other parts of Canada because this was a free place. 100. So, like, like be real. I the know. natives, they've erased their whole history. Mm-hmm. Bro, we can't even speak on that. Oh, they've my erased God. their whole yeah. history. Instagram will come for us. Black History Month. If we go into... Oh, man. They ain't ready yet. Instagram's not ready. Their whole history's gone. They can't even... Bro. Everything. Every single thing. They only thing. know certain things they were told. Yeah, yeah man. Or whatever Disney movie They have that blind day. spots <laughs> in the history worse than ours. Yeah. yeah. They still think Johnny Depp's probably... <laughs> oh. <laughs> bro, I'm just keeping it real. Listen, you know how long I thought when I was watching Moses or Ben Hur and thing? I'm like, yo, oh, I didn't know. Like, I thought the... What was it? The Egyptian, like... I thought these were white people for real. As a kid, man, and then of course, eventually you open up your eyes when you do your liquor research. But they that took us a as long kids, time. Right? Mm-hmm. Yeah, our bro. Own people, they've been portraying our own people as white, black people. All day, you know what I'm saying? All day. But you're just watching it. They're being told because again, that's how that media piece and what you said. The attitudes are fixed. It's like, yeah, no, it was always like this. Yeah, no. Mythology is uh, African gods that they've made their own. One hundred. One hundred. Yeah, I'm looking at that it, shit the other day, bro. That shit's Egyptian. Yeah. Oh, that's like, bro, it's just not even written in Greek. Mm-hmm. I know. You gotta thank the Africans for this, but like, yo, you look at the the way the bodies are shaped. 
Nah, come on, bro. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Gladiators yeah. weren't built like that. It was all Dwayne Rock Johnsons. Every <laughs> They had a few big guys, but they didn't have gladiators that were built like that were built like Africans. Nah, like, we know this. Yeah, bro. It's not racism. It's why they kept them in the gladiator. Cause, cause you imagine, bro. Our statues are built differently than theirs for a reason. Cause we were built differently. Yeah. Our, 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 we sorry. ate differently. We we were physical differently. Yeah. So what you eating? I mean pork. We nah, lived in a different part of the world. Yeah. <laughs> you know. What I mean? <laughs> our climate was hot. We were sweating all day, walking long distances. All the things. It was nothing. And I think that's just said it's crazy, yo. Because that's like They had thing. these ad, these advanced civilizations in, in, in Europe which weren't really advanced. Yeah. But they were clo- they had more things that were closer together. They did more of that work. Yeah. Africa more was natural. It was that was still more advanced than, than Europe. And, oh, 100. And any any time. To the point, right? We but have, we still use yeah. old and ancient uh, uh, uh um I should say ancient sciences. Yeah, we right. have, bro, they're, they're like the breadwinners. I mean, for example, genetic warfare was an African. It's the dude, what's his name? Hannibal. Mm-hmm. Hannibal, the most famous, Um, he's the most People famous. People think that's not a real story. Don't think it's bro, real. it's a real story. I feel like Chappelle, he's in that, well, I don't give a, yo, it's a real story, bro. You know what I mean? Like, it's just crazy to know that this man had wars with everyone up and down the Europe side to the point where Italy was his main conquest, you know? Mm-hmm. But it was, he was the one that was bringing genetic warfare, as simple as mixing the shit when putting it in whatever in fire, like, I, not that I would or not think of that, but God damn, because mm-hmm. he's thinking to himself, once it hits you, even if it scrapes you, that was the point, the actual shit or whatever mm-hmm. the hell they tipped it with, you should be gone in the next, like, few hours to, mm-hmm. like, a day at most. I shouldn't even have to go chase you. Like, I cannot believe the forethought out of a man like that. And then, you know, you burn it, you throw it. This guy created genetic warfare, and he did many other things. That's just one example. But he was such a threat. That still to this day, the army, the United States Army specifically, chooses and they still go through his tactics to this day. Mm-hmm. Just like TTC uses our color to this day. It's like it just makes peanut butter to this. I'm just kidding though. I, I know some other people were part of that. But it's just, it's incredible to me because it's like you use that that ideology. What you said is perfect because it's almost like, a, it's like the way they did with hip hop. It was like watching this come to fru- uh, tuition, you know, in the streets of New York where, where all these freaking color kids and mm-hmm. where is he, what the hell is this newspaper for what the hell is this bro I thought the buildings were burning we trying to get you guys the hell out I <laughs> thought when we made that little you know that highway to get to Manhattan I thought y'all were leaving how are y'all <laughs> still dancing here it's hip hop bro and like you learn and it's like oh snap but if I have they didn't expect us to be happy 100 we little we had. you know and then you use that money I'm so sorry I'm snapping looking at my nose you use that, that uh, what's it called that mentality again where it's like you have a young guy who's in the hood and you're like yo I'll give you 20 grand if you sign, like mm-hmm. ever, yeah, just give me everything. Too many BT movies, we can't even count. Remember the ninety-eight cents? It was like BT the. Uh, I'm only. I'm only one? No, it wasn't that. I'm only Candy giving the ones. Cre- yeah, yeah, yeah. New edition. I'll gi- I'm only giving the ones credit that didn't have Google. One hundred. Those are the only ones I'm giving credit to. One hundred. You don't have Google and you don't have money to go talk to a lawyer, so I'll give those ones credit. All day, right? You're Yo, trying to get the fuck out of here. Anyone who just that like, used their mind and like, there's many people and examples of that. Like, but black, even if you don't do well, your research, you should. If you're use a this, hustler. Yep. Bro, you, Malcolm X, if man, you're a hustler, on, you're not just going to sit there and think you're a star and make money. Bro, it's no. not how shit works anywhere. No. Jeezy doesn't just wake up, be a star, and come money comes to him. No, that yeah. nigga is a crazy mind, a mega yeah. mind. Like, yo, what's her name? Like, uh, what's her homegirl? The one with the, the hair? They even did like a, like a show. I, ah. hey, him and No, and there's a young woman when you just said that. Not a young woman now, but she was like the richest black woman in America. She was like the Oprah Winfrey of her time. She did the hair curling products. Oh, CJ. Yeah, CJ Walker. Case in point, you married, you know what I'm saying? Like mm-hmm. what you're saying is case in point, because she just using whatever little time she had with a little apprentice that was doing her own thing, mm-hmm. and just saw that, and like still try to build with her and still getting rejected. Nah, you too dark girl. You matter. It was like one of them uh, precious scenes. Mm-hmm. Like you ugly. You can't do that. Mm-hmm. You know what I'm saying? She's like, all right, cool, cool, cool. I got like my ten or fifteen hours off you of learning. I'll see you later, nigga. She's a hustler. Boom, 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 boom. You know what I'm saying? Off of the top, like it's incredible, and again, that beautiful idea of family and just community because it's just a few people. But it's amazing how two or three people, like this, what they say, a few people can change the world. It's so true, yeah, yes, so true. Yo, if you really, yo, if you put the energy in, you you know, get it out all day, man. And black people have been doing it for years and eons, man. They just take and take, but it's not always a sad story because there's things like Motown. I can be happy for that, that you know, there's a black man that looked for black kids. 
Yeah, but he's still, still doing them wrong, though. I know, I know, but... It, I mean, I can't say it's wrong. It's business, but it's, it's still wrong. I know, I know. At le- yo, listen. Sam Cook, Sam Cook. You should not be able to take anybody's ownership over anything yeah. without the opportunity to get it back. That's 100. Like, I understand if... This is why I say Sam Cook does shine a little bit. Yo, they, they should be able to get their match back within three or five years of that contract. Oh, yeah. There's absolutely no way that you walk away from that contract owning them. Yeah. That's, that's, that, that is slavery in yeah. any form. I don't care mm-hmm. how you word it. Yeah. It is. All day. Yeah. You put the money up. You didn't put on anything into the craft. Mm-hmm. And he's a lot of these artists, the ones who signed to majors. You do deserve some sort of ownership. Yeah. You don't get to own their masters. Yeah. You can own the name. There's copyrights on that stuff, but that's not something you should be owning either. Mm-hmm. It's crazy. You you can get a piece of the pie. I'm All not. I'm not. I'm not saying you don't deserve a piece of the pie. You put money in. Mm-hmm. No, one hundred. You don't get a hundred percent of anyone's masters, mm-hmm. though. Yeah. No. But that's, that's a Wu Tang mentality to bring because that's how you want it. Even if it's a force, like even if it's a percentage, a percentage, it's still. Well, Jizza owns Rizza owns all the the royal the, the the masters. They don't own their their masters. Jesus, man, you know. <laughs> Rizza owns all that. Even dead. But the thing is, I I have to I have to say though, Rizza was the one he put in all the money, the time, yeah, and the effort. You know what I mean? There it's would be no Wu Tang. There lot. would be no Wu Tang without Rizza. Bro, there not... would absolutely be no Ghostface Killer. No, for sure, for sure, for sure. Just the idea of ODB and his rap. And Bro, his we stuff. look at it's them like... now. We see that. We see the hustle. They would have been nothing without him. One hundred. And if he would have just put them on and left them, they would have been nothing. Yeah. They didn't hustle it. The only one that came became anything, really, that became, um, uh, I should say, uh, not say anything, but a business. Yeah. Method Man. And that's not really a business. He just kind of did a one-two acting. It wasn't gigs that weren't that big. Yeah. You know what I mean? He didn't and turn it into a clothing yeah. line or anything. like. That always got me. And I think I think that was a joke, because I think sometimes these guys, like, I remember the, oh, no, but that would be the Wu line. That wouldn't even be his own line. It's no. No. That's and that's point. RZA. That's he crazy. gives him a piece. Yeah, 100 is the one with the ownership. The education is so important, guys. So important. Even amongst our people. And I think that's a good part. Because you do want to make sure always you, you just step up. Or at least know something. Like, for me, it's just knowing that I can... I know someone like a, a legal lawyer or something that I know I trust that we can, like... Hey, man, here's some Give paper real. people gave me. Or was this... You know what I'm saying? Like, yo, it should just be simplistic. And I think that's crazy that you're saying that. Because, again, we... Even right now, as we talk about the show, like, me and you may face litigation. But <laughs> we're going to have to know what the fuck to do. And I'm going to be calling you tonight. It was my point because Lord knows. It's Black History Month, though. We can say shit. Tracks. Color people's night. <laughs> you know? But I like that, man, because that's the idea. Because with, again, this idea of mental health and, and the whole idea of what we talk about history, too. From yeah. Europe to America, I've always noticed that difference. A Caribbean. I can't talk about China, bro. I don't even know what's going on in China, bro. They don't. They let us know. We didn't want to know. I just, yeah. I just take in what I see. You know, but it's like I've always found it interesting because Europe, it always feels like class. Like I've, I've never had a person, an officer. I was shocked the first time, I like an officer asked me, "Hey man, you want some help?" And the fuck off! What the hell? In my mind, though, of course, you know the black man was making sure not to make any sudden movements. But I was so shocked to my core, bro. Like he generally just wanted to know if he could help. He even had the clipboard out and everything. And I just, it took about five minutes to really let it sink in. And then a couple more times later, I'm like, oh, okay, so this is not like, oh, because then where's the white lady? So, oh, so I'm not that different. Oh, and it was like, wow, bro. And it was just, it blew my mind. I didn't feel like no immigrant. I didn't feel like whatever. And the only time you felt different was when you didn't speak Spanish and they're talking bare shit about you. You know that. That's the <laughs> only time where you're like, bro, I am not of this country. But I felt that difference. And we all know, because if we've all been to the States once or twice, and we all know Toronto, such a mentality where it's not different. Class is a thing. But it's not as big a thing as the racial. Like, Canada has, has like, you know, we're racist, but I feel sometimes we're... I wouldn't say that. I would feel we're on the low. Racially? I, yes. I'd say, I'd say um, in low, America... Low, yeah. No, I'm speaking on America. Oh. You, said, you, said, you said it's not you said it's said um, it's not as class as it is racial, and I say it is. Oh. You, you think know. white people... You think rich people, white people like... Because then we would have to... Yeah, they, it goes to religion. The yeah. poor white people are still niggers to them. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. I just mean it as in, like, the full... Like, it's what drives the nation. Like, meaning if me and you were rich... We're getting the same... If we walk into that hotel, we're going... In Europe, we're going to the same room that was there. I feel like if me and you are black, we might end up in the same department, same mm-hmm. level. I don't think it'll be the same exact attitude. I feel like... What, here? Like, if we're here or whatever, I feel like if we have that money, there's going to be a certain respect. 
but it doesn't also come with just like it doesn't wash away the fact we're black. I feel there's still gotta be we still gotta ring up, ring up. Like mm-hmm. I feel like in Europe, like I could just you know I don't even have to get to the ring. They're already ready. It doesn't matter if the tiger shit behind my back. It was just like yo, there's a. Well, it doesn't matter, but I didn't feel it. <laughs> you know, I just felt like, yo, man, they just sit with you and chill. Satisfaction guarantee. They just want to have a cigarette. They just want to have a coffee. They just want to, like, you didn't give a fuck who you were. It was dope if you're from Toronto. <gasps> you know, of course, the only Canada. time I felt racial <laughs> shit was the Americans, bro. Oh, I remember one American girl was in Italy, and I'll, I'll stop at this point. She was like, yo, man. <laughs> I was like, walking the other day, and uh, I just, I couldn't believe it. Because I looked at an African in the face. She said it to you? <laughs> to me, bro. Like, as, like, dog, you already, bro, my kids with me and it's like, nah, I can't, but you're too young. Dude, those white like, people that they can share everything they know about black people with you. These white girls go out, like, and I just, I felt so proud of myself. And I'm like, whoa. For real. <laughs> you know what I mean? But like, you know, we're in a business establishment and I know these motherfuckers and shit, so it's like, all right, keep talking that shit. But it would only be an American anywhere I went. Anytime I heard some, hey, man. Yeah, nah, 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 nah. like that's what I knew as American. Any outside of that, it was always some like I knew where I was because no one gave a shit outside yeah. of that. And again, unless you spoke some, no hablé, no hablé español. Hey, 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 hey. Yeah, <laughs> Madre true. puta madre, yo, that do they have big penis? <laughs> it sounds shit. but it's, it's definitely it's, something I'm gonna ask you. Yeah, you know, I'm just saying, it sounds shit. But on some real it's just and again when I say the and I'm just stopping at the point because I just think the mentality piece. It's how we're fed, I feel, almost like in a, in a way of speaking, where what we're fed in society, we'll latch on to. And it's like, we have open minds. I feel we don't have a choice. It's color people. It's like, nah, you got to be just open because yeah, you got to have the opportunity. Yep. Because, you know, you mean just the opportunity? No, no, no. Open to every, like yeah, open. Because if we're not open, then it's like, well, you should understand. Yeah, all the time. But we should understand. Anyone should, really. Really, right? And it's just crazy. Because, I mean, I've learned again with black people, for example... Like, Africans don't feel the same way. They hate us. Talk, you know what I'm saying? They hate us. And the Caribbeans don't feel the same way as the Americans because, you know, they don't understand because they fought it. Nah, man. I find Caribbeans... They're, like, in between. I feel yeah. like it depends. So, Haitian... I don't think... Okay, okay, okay yeah, you're right. There's, you different, what I'm there's different Caribbean Holy. things. Because Jamaicans are, like... In like, they're in all places. All, yeah, 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 it's like, yeah, but... Hey, oh, man. You're right. Haitians don't like everybody. Not at Remember, all. Remember, they they're worried on their own city. You know You know... I just found out Haiti is not an island. <laughs> Yo, I don't even know. The- what is it, DR? What is it? What's what? attached to it? What Dominican. Re- what's, what's attached to, to Haiti? Oh, uh, um, wait. It's oh. the DR, right? Let me look that up. I have to actually yeah, look check that. Yo, I, I couldn't yeah, believe it. Yeah, it's another right beside and, it. And, 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 oh, it's the ones who don't think they're black. That's why they call it Haiti the Dominic- niggers. No, yeah, the, yeah, it's yeah. Dominican, yeah. I think it is Dominican. Yes, yeah. the ones who don't right think they're niggers. Right across the, yo. Yes. Yes, I see why you say, yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, I just okay. found out. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. they're both islands. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Thought Guyana was an island, too. <laughs> Fuck. <laughs> Happy I found that out. Right? We learned some new shit out here, bro. It's, yo. No, we figured it out. Oh, you figured it out. Yeah, it's definitely no, it's, Jamaican. It's definitely Jamaican. You sure? Oh, oh yeah. no, bro. This so, oh, we can't even get into them storylines, bro. Holy. You know, the ones who say they're not black, they're not black. Yeah. Mm-hmm. And they might, they look darker than me. I know black. Yeah. I know black. I know black, do you? <laughs> Right next door to Haiti. <laughs> Holy, bro, yo. They're having kids with Haitians talking about that they're not black. Right? No, don't kill me, bro. Yeah, yo, they done some effed up things to each other, though. I know, black. Like, awesome women. Yo. <laughs> and it's crazy because we always got respect. Yo, shout out to the Haitians. The first ever successful revolution uh, in history. Yes. To this day. The and only how small the island is. <laughs> well, they're half an island. You, not, well, hey, well, you know what? At that time, to them... Yeah, I think at that time, it was right? definitely a full island. We didn't have a, Google. I don't think it was Dominican <laughs> at that point, right? Wherever we could be free was good enough for us. We but there was no Dominican at that point, though. No, not necessarily. No, That was Haiti. That was pretty much Haiti. Okay. And, and at that time, again, because the French colonized, they, they had, you know they had their local politics. Mm-hmm. Once they had to run, though, you know they had to trace the line. Mm-hmm. Okay. Okay. Where we, where we, oh, snap. Yeah, before we run out of footage. Archer would say the danger zone. Holy. crazy. So, yo, um, um, socials, platforms, all the good stuff. Yeah. Yo, once again, uh, really excited. I just want to give a shout out to Rico Live right here. Uh, and to my queen. Uh, and to my, my two people who have kept very legally silent at times. <laughs> outside of answering the question. Very just, legally silent. I want to emphasize on that, you know? So, when I, I get thought. home. Yes, barely. yes. Well, barely. legally speaking, she said the right things, right? She barely, barely. Was, yeah, that's the term she's gonna use in court, sir. I barely spoke. <laughs> what? Can you just? 
<laughs> Eli, can you back me up? Like, you know, it's like, you know, I don't, like, Jesus Christ, I was talking about <laughs> jail and open relationships and like, shit, like, the, the fuck, man. I swear it's like, over 50 words. It, it was live. It was live. I did it. <laughs> was it was... live, Rico? <laughs> I didn't know. He said it was a B-roll and <laughs> it was a certain amount. <laughs> Yeah, and I'm saying all this so that you don't, of course, do see this shit. Oh, my God. We knew. We knew the flex. We caught the flex before she brought it. Oh, was it was, I forgot what date is. 20th, 25th, whatever. Court will find out. Oh, my the cameras God. Cameras don't lie. Cameras don't lie. Yo. <laughs> so do I said lie. what I needed to Digital say, okay? Footprint. Oh, yeah. She gonna put her pla- her real ones, though, right? Because we gonna get some justice tonight. Yeah. So all them, uh, yo, what is it? Should we shout out, uh, shout out some of the prisons still not playing? <laughs> Joyceville. Joyce. Oh, Shout out. Oh, shit. Out. That's There's cool. some memories. Don't live like people do. They always uh, stop this. And the traveling man is the UPS guy. Or is it uh, Uber? Whatever whatever they're getting nowadays over there. No, it's crazy, it. yo. <laughs> yo. Yo. Hope you dropped the next. <laughs> and he knows you can't play the trash. You gotta write the actual lyrics out for him. <laughs> so that he can read it when he's there. It's memory. Oh, no, you they can take that. The phone. They might take the words out, though. You know, like when they get home. Um, nah, like, we chose, chose, you chose. can't learn too much. Chose. No, and for it, it's most Yasin Bay. This chick don't, <laughs> don't, don't mess up the play. song. <laughs> yeah, I'm done. I'm done. Mm-hmm. Yo, J Maroon, before I mess up. <laughs> no, what's it? J Maroon, done no J to the dot to the M A R O N. Oh, oh, and sorry. You already know, Rico Live, I'm really happy to be here with my boy, with my gals, with the queens and the kings. You already know, peace. He said his name is Jay Moron. Jay, I just caught that, right? That's why I put the, the double O-N after that. That's why I said it. For the record, you, you're you going to hear it, though. You'll hear it in the after. Let me just say it again. Let me spell J-M-A-R. Oh, oh, get it, guys. And I feel like Hooked on Phonics. Remember the one? Yo. <laughs> like, Yo. Your yeah, friend is troubled. Your friend is slow. I had this cassette. <laughs> it was a Hooked on. It was a whole series of things. It was like, he, a whole bunch of foxes, I right? Think he needs step three. He needs Joelle's. No, because like, he spelled his name today. They met Ebonics, eh? <laughs> Yo. Oh, my God. It was a play off of Ebonics. Bro. Oh, no. You're killing my mind today. See, Hooked on Phonics. Oh, shoot. Someone should actually come up. With telling you learn English, nigga. <laughs> it's not. <laughs> See, but that's why it was cassette Horrible. tapes. We're at this. Yeah. Horrible. <laughs> that's, but it I'm feels Jasmine so real. I'm XO on all social media platforms. Hey, hey. <laughs> oh, he, uh, we know him. Yo, shout out to Rico Line. Yeah, Respect. Yo, yeah, um, yeah, just scatter boy on all social platforms. Hey, 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 hey. Ear, 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 ear. And I am your host. This is Rico the Menace. Y'all know where to find me. Um, make sure y'all like, subscribe, comment, ring off a notification bell, rrr, all that good stuff. This has been another fun time. How much time is this say we did there today? You see? Psst. Sir, one might say we We're passed the Netflix one. special. God damn, an hour and a half? <laughs> I didn't even realize I had that much space. So I only had 12 gigs. Holy shit. <laughs> I was really wondering when is this going to stop? Your phone's dead. But um, listen... We have a small thing we do here. We know we like to remind y'all that y'all is special. Spread love, yeah, give love, receive love. Call somebody, tell them you love them. Yeah. You know? Or write them um, <laughs> as, as, as our queen told us, write that one that you never Yo. got a chance. Now <laughs> we know. Write them, <laughs> man. Write them. Them need it, man. Yeah. Peace easy and we will see y'all soon. Bra all that good shit. Bye bye, yeah. Rico Live. Don't know. We're a network. Powered by Rare Network. It's powered by Rare Network. <laughs> powered by the Rare Network. Powered by the Rare Network. You already know they're powered by Rare Network. CMT. Thanks for watching. Like and subscribe for more videos. Remember, Central Sundays live on Instagram each and every Sunday. Click the left for One Take TV podcast or click the right for family time. See y'all soon.